Okay. And here we are, chat. So welcome. Today we are going to be playing Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Tag Force for the PSP. Now, I've had my eye on the Tag Force games for a little bit. I figured they could be something good and fun to play. I, I tried looking at some of the DS games as well, but th it seems like they run a little slow compared to uh, this game, so let's give it a try. Plus, there's the obvious thing about the, um, hang on. There's the obvious thing about the, uh, hang on, the two screens being captured. Also, what's that default name? What a strange thing. Don't worry where that default name came from, chat. Don't worry. <laughs> what am I doing? Why is over here? I'm just checking chat, making sure everything's fine. Yeah, that's my name. Okay. New game data. Yep. I, that, this is just me making sure the game worked uh, the other the other night. Okay. Yep. Save complete. Okay. Just like making sure that it saves and all that stuff. Okay, let's give it a go. The first of May, Monday. You must be Asprey. Welcome to Duel Academy. I'm Chancellor Shepard. We aim to create the next generation of duelists. Study hard to become the next king of games. In three months, there will be a huge event on campus. We'll hold the Tag Force Duel Tournament. You need to make friends to find your tag partner. That's it for the introductions. Class is about to begin, so go to the classroom. At classroom, your teacher, Velian, awaits you. Make sure to do what Velian asks. He means Crowler, right? That's Crowler's first name, pretty sure. Explanation, move using the directional buttons or analog stick. Leave the office and go to that. Select talk in the menu. You can talk to a nearby person. Okay. This looks like a browser game from like uh, 15 years ago. Like, look at this. Anyways, check here. First thing I want to do is go to options, because... Yeah, let's set the speed up here. I want to leave the effect on for now. Turn that on. Message speed very fast. There we go. Did it save? Okay, good. We're making sure we turn that stuff on first because the game will be a little slow otherwise. Thanks for the sub there, friend. It was just in the middle of the explanation. To Duel Academy Classroom. Yeah, it's been a bit since I did some Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm excited for it. Talk. Hee <laughs> hee. There's a new student coming today. His scores on the admit admit admittance test... <laughs> like biting my tongue in the middle of that for some reason. Rather impressive. This may be my chance to get rid of Dropout Boy. Ha ha ha. Ha? Huh? How long have you been there? I can talk, I swear. Ahem. My name is Velian Crowler. I'm by far the top teacher in the entire academy. Feel free to brag to your friends about me. Ah, so you're Asprey, the new transfer. Yeah, I beat you here. Oh, wait up, Jaden. Silence or it's detention for you. Oh no, not that. Asprey, don't become a slacker like him. Now I'll explain what I expect from you in this class. You have class every day from Monday to Saturday. Class begins promptly at 8 a.m. Don't be late. Study hard and you'll catch up in no time. You have a little time till class starts. Talk to the other kids, make some new friends. All right. There are other teachers in this world, right? I've never seen you before. You knew? I'm Chumley, Chumley Huffington. I flunked a year, so I'm still a freshman. Can't walk around him. It's the Chaz chat. What do you want? A slifer slacker talks to the Chaz Princeton? What nerve. Stop bugging me. Step off. There we go, and there's the greatest dork in the whole series. You're the new transfer who came today. I'm Bastion Misawa. Nice to meet you. Class will start soon. I'll see how bright you are. I keep getting stuck on corners already. You're new here, aren't you? I can tell a lost puppy when I see one. I'm Alexis Rhodes. Hope we'll be friends. If you ever get lost, feel free to ask me. 
So you're new. Hmm. Zane, no need to glare. This is Zane Truesdale, top duelist at Duel Academy. So you probably noticed that, um, I, I believe that Legacy of the Duelist takes all of its portraits from, from the Tag Force games, right? I believe that's what I heard, and it seems like that's the case. Hey, you're the new kid. Heard all about you. I'm Jaden Yuki. I'm the top Frosh Duelist. Sweet to meet ya. Hope we get the duel soon. Oh, hi, you're the new transfer, right? I'm Cyrus Truesdale. Not that it matters. You'll get better grades than me in no time. No wonder your grades suck with that attitude. All right, and that's everybody, right? 92 days until tournament. Class is about to begin. Take your seats, children. Take your seats. Time for class. All seven of us are the only students at the academy, apparently. All right, this is tutorial. I'm just going to skip that. Big number, destroy small number. That's how, how old Yu-Gi-Oh work. Does, I checked it earlier. It doesn't really tell you anything. We're done with today's lesson. Asprey, I'll show you to your dorm. It's just a very slow tutorial that teaches you the order of, like, you know, the game. And how to take your turn and all that. Actually, I'll handle it. I'm Professor Lyman Banner. And I'm going to not do his, like, actual dub voice, because that's weird. I teach alchemy, and I'm the headmaster of Slifer Dorm. I'll leave it to you, Professor Lyman Banner. Asprey, please follow me. His first name is, is Lyman? So, is that because he's a man who tells lies? Hmm. This is your new home, Slifer Red Dorm. Meow. Oh, hi, Pharaoh. This is Pharaoh. He's everyone's favorite. Er. This is such a great dorm, even the cats love it. Your room is 204. Oh, but before. It's dinner time, so eat first. Dinner's at 7 p.m. Meals are always first come, first serve. So if you come late, there may be no food left. Eyes forward, students. Please join me in welcoming a new student. Asprey is just transferred to Slifer Red. I know you'll all get along. Now, Asprey, introduce yourself. You speak with energy, speak quiet quietly. I'm saving my energy. New kid's kind of depressing. Okay, Jaden. Well, wouldn't you be if you're put in Slifer Red? That's true. Well then. Hooray! Hooray, Asprey! Come on, Jaden. Don't be sad because you're in Slifer. We're here for you. See? You've already made friends. Jaden, Cyrus, and Chumley. After the meal, show Asprey our dorms. Or our rooms. Leave it to us, Teach. Good. Now let's eat. Wait, is Blair already there? Yeah, that's Blair. Ew. Chow down big time. Alright, Asprey. I'll take you to your room. Like, right next to me there. That's clearly Blair. Jaden, wait up. Shouldn't run for an hour after we eat. Whatever. Let's go. Well, I guess I am popping in the middle of the year. Not the start. This is your room, Asprey. No roommates? Then you get this room all to yourself. Lucky. But if you get lonely, stop by our room. We're only two doors down. Well, it's getting late. Time to catch some Z's. Yeah, Asprey looks pretty wiped out. Let's go back to our room. See you tomorrow. Class starts at 8 a.m. Don't oversleep. Explanation. Class begins at 8 a.m. Time appears at the top right of the screen. It's 4 at yeah, 5.45 right now. You still got time. Take a walk around the island. Use the directional buttons to move and exit the room. To run, move while pressing that. To record your progress in the game, save point on the bottom left of the map. That appears when you're outside. Warning, if you end the game without saving, you'll lose your previous save point. Or return to your previous save point, you know what I mean. Meow. Uh, pet his head? You pet him on the head. Meow. He didn't seem to like it. Okay. 
Database. Okay, I don't need to mess around with that stuff. Can I talk to my TV? No. Let's just go outside. Oh, stuck for a second in the doorway. You're new, right? I'm Gillian. They say that Slifer Red is for loser duelist, but we'll show him a thing or two. I know. Let's have a duel. Talk to me like before and challenge me to a duel. Directions. How to challenge someone to a duel. Yeah, I saw the option. This challenge is a nearby person. Duel. Very well. Then it's a duel. Okay. Draw. Alright, just pick one, buddy. Second to go. And it's old era, so I get the I still draw on the first turn, right? Nothing that matters is uh I'll do it. Start duel. Alright. Hey, I got negate attack, chat. That's the one that stops spell cards, right? Amphibian beast. Okay. It's a good start there. Should I put something in defense mode? I highly doubt he's gonna have anything to hit me, and I got negate attack anyway, so... Let's set it. Change phase. Turn end. Bolt penguin. Here I go! My turn! Draw! I set a monster. I set a card. I end my turn. Draw phase. Okay, what's this guy? Night Lizard. A lizard warrior protected by a hide of very tough emerald scales. That looks like that other monster. Now then, I don't want to sacrifice this strong thing. I probably got... Like, Umi in the deck here. So for now, let me just go ahead and do this. Probably could have Mirror Force or something. Change phase. Alright. Audio and everything all good, chat? How's it sound? He's got Water Monsters too, chat. Direct attack. Just like the anime. Alright. That's that. End turn. Audio nice. Excellent. Here I go. My turn. Draw. So, is there supposed to be voice acting in like the Japanese version or something? And they just uh, didn't dub it or something? Check guard card details. Okay, nice of it. Let me do that. I end my turn. Oh, he's not even gonna attack? That was, uh, pretty stupid of you, buddy. Not gonna lie. Pretty, pretty damn stupid, not gonna lie. He should at least, like, trade the monsters here. Not that- he, I could've stopped him anyway, but it's fine. Battle phase. Okay. They got rid of voice acting in English release? Okay. Doesn't shock me. Ugh. You just got slaughtered, buddy. And with that, turn is over. Oh no. My turn. Draw! From my hand, I activate my field spell. That helps me too, dumbass. I can see it. Control stick scrolls. I set a monster. I end my turn. Alright. Oh, he's about to get slaughtered now. Monster equip this increased attack by 700 points. Increased by 700, 200 by each of the standby phases. Unnecessary, but fine. Okay. Actually, you know what? I'll just go ahead and use this on that one thing. It's not gonna matter because he's gonna die anyway. Just to guarantee he dies here. 
Also, this track is sick. I meant to hit this one. Yeah! Ugh. All right, he's about to get completely wiped out now. It was sure was nice of him to activate that field spell to buff all of my monsters. Where are they getting buffed? Ah! No, he's supposed to do a dramatic effect where he just, like, falls backwards and breaks his spine. Reduced to zero. Oh, there it is. I lost. That's right, you lost, Gillian. Excellent. You won easily, but don't let it get to your head. Let's duel again sometime. Oh, I can just open everyone's door? That's pretty rude. Look at me go. There's no one to talk to. Alright, let me get closer then. Hiya, I'm Hero. Nice to meet ya. You hear that rumor? They say something's under this island. I think it's probably some dinosaur fossils or maybe buried treasure. Either way, it's got to be worth a fortune. I'm Michael. What's up? There's a forbidden dorm on the island, you know? Well, to be honest, I'm not really interested in it. Hi there. My name's Tristan. Is that... That's a weird way of saying the name Tristan. Is that how you say it? I don't think Tristan's correct. Nice to meet you. You know Cyrus Truesdale from Slifer Red? I heard Cyrus Truesdale has a real older brother, as opposed to a fake one. I don't believe we've met. I'm Rio. Nice to meet you. You know a dude named Jaden Yuki? He stands out, so I bet you've heard of him. He made that awesome comeback victory during the test. Man, I'd love to duel him. Oh, I hit the edge of the map. Everyone's just around here. So I've got time to wander the island. The beach, the forest, the abandoned dorm. Bastion's at the cliff. Let's go there. Who are you, chumps? Hey, I heard about you. My name is Craig. Nice to meet you. Rumor says Emperor Zane has a younger brother and that he's in this school. I bet he's as good as Zane. No, I'm clearly talking to this guy. Oh, hey there. My name is Matthew. Nice to meet you. Sorry, I spaced out a lot. I used to think Jar of Greed was a worthless card, but I heard you can use it to make your deck smaller. Hmm, but I still don't see the point of doing that. Nothing else here. Where's Bastion? I'm gonna go make fun of him. Hi, Asprey. You came to see the ocean, too? Whenever I look at the ocean like this, all my worries are washed away. What do you want to talk about? Uh, duels, hobbies, the academy, rumors? What's your hobby? Thanks for asking. You had a good talk. Oh. Alright, good talk indeed. That's it for today's training. I guess I'll head back to the dorm. All right, I got friendship points with Bastion, I suppose. Is it just random what he wants to talk about? All the lads are at the dorm. 15 minutes went by by going to the cliffs. I wish that's how time actually worked. What if I go here? Hmm, you're from Slifer Red, aren't you? I'm Hyde. I think it's the first time we met. Are there any students that get on your nerves? I've got one. He's from Raw Yellow, named Bastion Misawa. So he did the best on the exam, and is the best in every sport. It still doesn't mean he can beat me. Surprise you're not telling me to get out of here because I'm wearing red. I'm Woody. Nice to meet you. Okay. That's a funny name, mister. They say some people can see and talk to dual spirits. Some people are even researching the subject. But I have nothing to do with that stuff. Unless, of course, a spirit comes to attack me. Ha 
Asprey, you have a way of dueling that takes full advantages of your strength. Thanks, I've done one with the starter deck. How should I put it? I know. It's unique. What do you want to talk about? Uh, duels, I guess? Hmm, well... You had a good talk. Alright. I had a good talk with Zane, everybody. Anything else here? It's the Chaz chat. I don't have time to talk to a loser like you. Get lost. Okay. He won't talk to you. Damn. No good talk with Chaz. Uh, who are you? Who are you? Hey, it's not like I asked you name. Or, ask you name. Oh, damn. Spelling mistake right away. Remember when I tried one of the DS games and there was a spelling mistake in, like, the literal first text box? Or grammar mistake, more accurately, I suppose, but... Whatever. I guess both kind of apply. Hope you're not a prowler. My name is Maki. Don't get the wrong idea. I'm just telling you my name. Not like I want to be friends with you. Have you heard about the wild man living in the forest? Some people claim they've seen him wandering around the woods, screaming like a crazed animal. I'm not scared, though. Hope you're not a criminal. What a weird conversation. <laughs> Can I talk to Dora? There's no one to talk to. All right. Excellent. I'm sure this game at least goes further than Duel Academy. Duel Academy only has, like, the first, like, 15 episodes worth of content, right? Okay. Can I go to the girls' dorm? You have to play as a guy in this game. That's the rule, I guess. Oh, Asprey. What do you want to talk about? The Academy? Oh, yeah, there's something I wanted to tell you. Aren't I not allowed to be here? I don't know. If I don't go ahead now, I'll be late for class. What do you want? I'm Jasmine. Oh, you're a transfer student. You're not bothering Alexis, are you? Oh, a transfer student. I'm Mindy. Hmm. I'll give you a C minus. By the way, did you want something? Or are you just admiring me? What do you mean C minus? What the hell is that supposed to mean? Hee hee, hello, I'm Yumi. Nice meeting you. Um, how do you construct your deck? You have a certain strategy in mind. Try continuous cards. There are many kinds, plus there are only so much you can do with, sp with trap and spell cards. And opponents just hate having them on the field. Why are- why are there raw yellow guys here? Who are you? I don't want to talk to anybody but girls. <laughs> okay, that explains why they're here. My name? It's, uh, uh... Daron? I've never seen that name before. What do you like better? Dark Magician Girl or Injection Fairy... Wow! Chat, you're invading the game. <laughs> the comments are invading the game. Anyway... A female spirit affairs, let me know. Oh my god. What is this dude's problem? Hey, any girls around here? This is the same dude with a slightly different shade of hair. Hey there, I'm Vyga. Uh, you look like a nice enough lad. I'm just... No, I just know we're gonna get along fabulously. I think duels are just the most marvelous thing. A fight of will and skill to the bitter end. Just fabulous. I'm getting goosebumps thinking about it. I'm talking to this dude again. What do you like better, Dark Magician Girl or Injection Fairy Lily? Okay. <laughs> I need to duel this guy. I want to see his deck. Hang on. What's he got? A duel? I'd prefer to be asked by a girl. Hehehe. <laughs> I'm busy looking for girls, so let's make it quick. Come on, let's duel. I don't have time to waste. Jeez. All right. You think this guy uses a Goku profile picture online? More than likely, yes. First to go. Normal duel. Let's go. Bring it on. Here I go. My turn. What's he gonna summon? 
That's it. I summon a monster. Uh, of, of, of course he's got her. Of course he does. Predictable. <laughs> he's running charmers, chat. My turn's over. <laughs> yep. What's this here? Well, Umi's on the field. This card's unaffected by spell cards. Mother Grizzly. Okay, one face down. 1850's kind of a problem, but hang on. Okay. Nightmare Pangolin. When this card is flipped face up, return one card to your opponent's side of the field to the owner's hand as long as this card remains face up on the field. Increase attack of all water monsters on your side of the field by 200 points. Okay. For now, probably start with this. Maybe I can get enough attack points to beat over her next turn. Okay. Let me see here. Guess that's pretty much it, huh? Here I go! My turn! Draw! This is it! Uh, okay. <laughs> Magician's Valkyria. I thought it was Magician's Valkyrie. Your opponent cannot select another spellcaster-type monster inside the field as an attack target. Okay, right, that's what it does. Let's battle! Take this! My monster attacks! Or, my waifu attacks! I use a face-down card. Oh, what's this one do again? You can only activate this, uh... Yeah, let me check it, please. You can only activate this card when a spellcaster monster declares an attack. Each player selects one spellcaster monster from their deck from the attack of 2,000 or less and special summons it to their side of the field. Uh, uh, okay. I don't think I can do that. I have one? Alright. Okay. That's it! I special summon a monster! Okay. Now I know what it does. This guy's gonna body me, chat. And I don't like that. Take this. My waifu attacks you directly. Now, more like it attacks that for now. Whatever, thin my deck a little bit. I need my uh, field spell. Select target from the field. Okay, let's send Dark Magician Girl back. I set a card. Okay, so all I got is monsters. And, all right. This will let me get Amphibian on the field if I can just keep myself alive. How many turns is it? Uh, two of your opponent's turns. No monster can attack. Destroy this card during your opponent's second end phase. He's just gonna get to build a whole field while I do that, but wait. Well, yeah. I don't really have much of a choice, though, do I? What can... I don't think Mother Grizzly's gonna get out anything cheesy because I'm running tons of vanilla monsters. I need my field spell more than anything. So for now, let's just do this and pray that I draw something good. Oops, wrong thing. Meant to go down. Looks like the waifu deck takes another W. Here I go. My turn. Draw. I said a monster. I set a card. End phase. My turn's over. Okay, alright, there's my field spell. Problem is, hang on. Aquatite monster, so it's not gonna affect her, because she's just spellcaster, but she's water. Alright, so I can't attack on my turn either. Hmm. Hmm, do I summon Amphibian Beast now? What if he has, like, a uh, Mystical Space Typhoon or something? May as well, I could just put this body on board, I guess. And, yeah, no monster can attack, including my own. Just making sure. Well, I guess that's that. Let me just double check. Always possible I might misread it. Turn end. Here I go. My turn. I act 
activate a spell. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Both players select one monster from their sides of the field and switch control of those monsters with each other. The selected monster's battle positions cannot be changed this turn. Except with a card effect. Oh, boy. Well, I guess I shouldn't have, uh, tribute summoned that. Now, shouldn't I? <laughs> okay. I'm getting, I'm getting the waifu beat down, chat. <laughs> I'm getting the waifu beat down. Share the pain. Tribute one monster on your side of the field. Your opponent must tribute one monster on his or her side of the field. Oh, wait, wait, what? Uh, my dude, I, I think you made a bit of an error with uh, which monster you gave me. <laughs> okay, then. Luckily, he has nothing powerful except my amphibian beast, so... Hmm... So they get to choose which one they sacrifice. So yeah, I could just take my monster back with uh, this. It's pretty silly. As long as this card remains face up on the field. Okay, so I'm gonna keep her on the field. Just, mm, I'm just worried about his two face downs. They haven't done anything yet, but what if I just attack into a mirror force? I mean, either way, he's not gonna have Amphibian Beast anymore, so. Flip summon. Take the fish. All right. Don't want to share the pain right now. So now I'm going to go ahead and summon this. Okay. All right. Let's hope I don't attack into a freaking mirror force now. But I can't let him keep building up his stuff because he's going to sat tribute for Dark Magician Girl if I don't do anything. Um... Okay. I have no choice but to attack this one first because of its effect. Oh! My waifu! How could you? You killed her! You monster. Alright. And I'll take effect damage because of the Magician, but I better get rid of his uh, high-powered one. I use a face down card. Oh, damn it. Yep. I know what it does. I know what it does. That's fine. All right. If that's the case, uh, she's just gonna, she's just a liability now. So let's go to main. Oh, I can quick open the menu with circle. I thought I tried that earlier and it didn't work. Well, that's handy. This whole time I was using triangle to open up this. I swear I tried it earlier and it wasn't doing anything. Well, whatever. Okay, let's activate Share the Pain. I'm gonna sacrifice your waifu. There we go. I still have the advantage. Oops, I'm still doing it now. And turn Endo. Thanks for gifting us up, yo-yo. My turn. I draw. From my hand? Uh-oh. I'm activating Mage Spell. I know what it does. Uh-oh. Let's battle. Take this! My monster attacks! Ouch. I set a monster. I need some spell removal now. Uh-oh. Yeah, he gets uh, 500 points for each spell or trap card on your side of the field, so 1,000 points to uh, area here. I actually liked the design of the Charmers a lot, but I just know that, um, you know, uh, people like our friend here are a little bit, little bit weird about them. There we go. Okay. So I guess for now I should just use uh, Mother Grizzly to kind of just get another monster on board after this. So you special summon an attack position. All right, I might have to cycle through Mother Grizzlies to stall. Still not doing that. All right, turn end, let's go. Huh. 
Heart of Greed. I don't need to check the details. I can read what- uh-oh. Magician of Faith. He's gonna... I'm activating the monster effect. Oh, he's using creature swap? Why? Uh oh I summoned a monster in attack position. Okay. Let's battle. Take this. My monster attacks. Ouch. Yes, I will. Alright, what do I got? I don't even know what's in my deck. Um... If I end the next attack on Humanoid Slime, I can put it in defense position on my turn, but it's still not a guarantee here. Hang on. Nice and engraving Roman Bells for some attack position from the deck. And shuffle your deck. What? Oh, Yomi Ship. If I put that on the field and he attacks into it, I just kill something. That probably would be the best thing I could do right now. What about this thing here? Oh, this is. Okay, so it's another, like, Mother Grizzly effect. I only have one Yomi Ship. All right, then, I'm gonna go with it. I'll take the damage. Take this! My monster attacks. Oh, he attacked with the strongest, too. The idiot. The AI is stupid. My turn's over. All right, now I just have to deal with Dark Magician Girl. Keep pressing triangle go. Here I go. My turn. Draw. Let's battle. Take this. My monster attacks. Ow. Oh. And now he sets a monster. Starboy. Heck yeah. Well... I can stall. And that's that, apparently. Here I go. My turn. Draw. Take this. Ow. Now he's just setting more cards. Oh. I can, uh, do this. Hmm, do I use it yet, or... I think what I need to do is I need to get something like, a uh, Kaiser Seahorse or something again. Put it on the field, use Negate Attack, and then summon Starboy to, uh, buff it so I can beat over Dark Magician Girl there. So for now, I just gotta keep stalling. Until I know I have something good in my hand. Oh, I told you he had MST. Wait, what? Wait, I don't have anything. Oh, he's using it on my, on my field spell, duh. Totally forgot the field spell spot for some reason. Ow. My turn's over. Now, what does this do? By tributing one torpedo fish on your side of the field, uh, b -b 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 by damage sphere in the field, you can try one spell trap card on the field. Okay. Well, I don't have that anymore. So this is level five, and it just beats over Dark Magician Girl. Hmm. I want. I potentially want to have Starboy's effect on board, though. Should I just take one turn of eating crap and see if I can draw a, a, a vanilla monster? What if he has another mage power or something? I feel like I have to take a risk either way. I'm just gonna let him eat. I'm just gonna eat crap for one turn. Why not? <laughs> Why not? Let him go. Uh oh. Yeah, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Let's battle. Oh, I can skip that with circle. That's fine. I know I can also turn it off, but they're funny. My monster attacks you directly. 
All right, now I gotta make the comeback play. My turn's over. Oh, hey, Humanoid Slime. I don't even need to use Negate Attack now. Okay. So I'll just put that down. Hmm. Fire monsters. None of these are fire. They're light and dark. It's only attack, not defense. That's fine. Okay. So many doesn't just summon a level 7. Uh-oh. What is this music? This sounds like a theme like a theme from uh the Clock Tower games where I'm being chased by like a scissor man or something. You better run. Or one of the really funky ones from uh Clock Tower 2. Waifu beatdown music. Oh, and now I got Amphibian Beast, even better. Now the problem we have here though, chat, is What if he's got Mirror Force? I don't really have much of a choice, though, so let's go for it. Battle phase. I have to target you as the face-up one. We gotta get rid of you first. I use a face down! Oh! <laughs> I got cylinder chat. Oh, well. You lose. All right. I win. I lost to anime girls, chat. I lost to anime girls. Might go easy on the girls, but not the guys. <laughs> Next time we do, will bring a cute girl with you, okay? What is with this man? Girls. Girls. I need girls. I can talk to this person. I'm Wade, a professor here. This is a girl's dorm. Don't loiter around. Male students aren't allowed past this point. How do you do? I'm Fonda Fontaine. You must be a transfer student. Nice to meet you. If you get in any trouble, just let me know. Alright. Who are you? What's that hair? Who are you? I'm Masha. Have we, uh, have we met before? Just got the worst memory, heh, but nice to meet you. Things can get difficult if you have bad memory. For example, uh, I know, the monthly test, the night before a written test is the worst. There's so many things we have to remember, but I can't do it at all. What will I do? I might have to drop out. All right. The waifu guy is literally in front of the security guard, and then we'll do nothing about it. Can I go to the abandoned dorm? Hey, I can. And suddenly, we're in a horror game. Ba bum bum ba bum Has anyone ever made, like, a horror game, like, a horror adventure game where, um, you play in, like, an isometric view like this? That'd actually be kind of cool. I don't think I've seen many of those. I believe this is our first time meeting. They call me Joshua. It is an honor. Do you know what the anti-rule is? If you play with an anti-rule, the loser gives the winner a card. An anti-rule makes it a game of true honor, because both players risk their own cards. The world does not easily forgive the weak. Perhaps someday you will learn this. Okay. Pretty sure dueling with an anti is illegal at Duel Academy. Thing here. Um, there's more people here. Just everybody just hang out here, or what? I thought it was forbidden. Who are you? Oh, you're the new student. You want to know my name? Sure. My name is Moses. Okay. Nice to meet you. Hey, Asprey. You know about spirits? Some people can actually see the card spirits. I guess Yomawari does kind of fit that idea, yeah. Dark magician girl spirits are cool, but... Spirits like the Goblin Elite Attack Force? Yikes, just the thought of them freaks me out. I wanted to play through the Yomori stuff again. Wasn't super big on the first one, but I want to give it another try. I've been getting through a lot of horror games lately again. Actually, keeping my promises for once. 
around here. This place is spooky. Check out that fireplace. The abandoned dorm. I guess that's it, just those two chumps. Spooky game for spooky day. It's 7 a.m. Not school yet. Let's go to the volcano. A duel allows you to strengthen yourself. You laugh, you cry, you grow as a person. Pippin is my name, and like you, I live to duel. It's great to meet you. They say a monkey lives in the forest, you know. Probably nothing more than a rumor, don't you think? I'd be interested if the monkey were a duelist. Okay. Just running up and down that. Check out that lava I can just get next to. Ugh, look at my muscles. I'm Alvaro. Scattering beads of sweat. Ugh, glistening through the air. Ugh. Oh, this muscle. Who could ask for more? Must be Asprey. I heard about you. You hear about the monthly test at the academy? There's a written test that tests your knowledge and a hands-on duel test that tests your skill. Why can't they include a physical fitness test? Most duels are determined by strength alone anyway. I won't lose. Time to lift some weights. Okay, bro. He's just training at the volcano. Seven fifteen. Raw yellow dorm. Let's try the harbor. I haven't been here yet. Hi there. I'm a uh, Ansa Anka. How do you say that? Nice to meet you. By the way, you've heard of North Academy, right? I wonder if people really get there by submarine. I mean, submarines go underwater, don't they? These dudes are the same. Hi, my name is Ivan. It's a pleasure to meet you. By the way, whenever I take my night stroll, I always catch a glimpse of two people by the lighthouse. They just stare out at the sea. I wonder who they are. Asper, you don't know anything about them, do you? Nice to meet you. I'm Terrence. I may not look like it, but I'm from Slifer Red. You're from Slifer Red too, right? Just like me. Nice to meet you. I always understand what's being said in class, but there's one thing I just can't figure out. Mr. Velian's always saying the word slacker. What does it mean? Is that the name of some cool card? <laughs> Haven't seen you before. I'm Ray. What's everybody got against Slifer Red? It's the coolest place in the world. I'll show you all the neat stuff here at the dorm. You can count on me. Anyway, good to meet you. Jade and Yuki is a major figure at Slifer. He says, get your game on before every match. It's kind of cool. Maybe I'll try it, too. Get your... Hmm. Not quite. Get your game! Hmm. No, can't say it right, chat. Catchphrase. Has a red jacket. Yeah, he definitely looks like he's from Slifer. Nothing else here, I guess. I mean, they clearly want me to be able to check, like, every location before I, like, uh, get into, like, my the rhythm of the game. Have I been to the forest already? I what, did, right? Okay. This is just a safe thing to leave open for people to walk in. Who are you? Oh, my name? Enzo. You know Professor Valian's weakness, right? He hates cats. Just make him- to make him mad, just use a cat. I'm, uh, Biven. Nice to meet you. Drawing power and dueling tactics are really important. It's impossible to be a great duelist without both. Howdy, kiddo. I'm Zanny. Don't go thinking I'm some kind of country folk. As I'm as slifer red as the best of them, so don't you'd best treat me right, friendly. Anyway, good to know you. This here's a nice fine island, seeing it, it's got all this nature and what have you. I fancy a duel just like the rest of y'all, but I'd rather be soul-searching in the woods. Don't you agree, Asprey? Looks like that's it for here. 
Look at all these NPCs I may or may not talk to again. The beach, maybe? Asprey, the transfer student. Hey, I'm Shannon. Glad to meet you. Seems to me that a lot of people are using decks full of effect monsters, so I think making a deck that cancels out effect monsters just might work. This man's thinking ahead of the game, but I've never done it, so I don't know. You ever tried a deck like that? Oh, ha Lad has no idea. Corey. Nice to meet you. He's doing like this conversation tonight. Man's like doing the SpongeBob meme. <laughs> Conversation denied. <laughs> okay. What's that dude's problem? I duel him, but he's blue, so he probably kicked my ass. It's time for class. Okay. Take your seats. Time for class. Oh. Today, we're following up on yesterday's class, the basics of dueling. Yesterday, we went over how duels work. Oh, uh... We're learning defense position. Yeah, okay. Great, great class, I learned. We're done with today's lesson. As a present, I'm giving everyone a card. You got Violent Rain. Okay. You got, uh, that thing. That might be better than those Kappas I got in my deck, at least. Hyo Sube. Ooh. Edit your deck to see the card I gave you. Go use your PDA to go to deck edit. Explanation. Every student has a PDA. A PDA is a mini computer. Has various uh, useful functions. Press square to use PDA. PDA has fallen functions. Edit the deck. Status. Mail. Check upcoming events on the calendar. Change game settings. End game. Edit your deck like Dr. Crowler mentioned. Press square to open that. Select deck menu. Okay. They clearly want me to replace some of those crappy monsters I got with those he just gave me. So. Ah. Uh, would you like to confirm? Okay. You'll be dueling with all sorts of opponents in the game. And you'll have to draw cards from a deck when playing a duel. You are able to edit your deck any way you like. I'm just hoping to learn the shortcut buttons by doing this. You can edit your deck here, which is the deck edit screen. Let's go over and edit your deck. Cards are divided up in the different categories. Look at these tabs to get an idea of each category. Selecting the deck tab allows you to view cards which are currently in the deck. Yes, I know. Go ahead and take a look. Press up and down. See which cards are in there. Cards used for the duel are in here. They will be shuffled and used throughout the duel as your deck. Moving on the tab that says trunk contains all the cards you've acquired so far. Any cards you've bought at the school store or acquired from somewhere else are stored in the trunk. And in your deck involves moving cards between deck and trunk. Simple enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Next time, I'll tell you about fusion inside. Important thing to remember for now is that moving cards back and forth between your deck and uh, trunk and deck is how you make your deck. Press X button on a card you want to move. Next step is move it somewhere. Yeah, it's simple enough then. And then it highlights the top thing. All right, good. I, yeah, I want to see if I actually have blue eyes right now, too, or if this is just the tutorial. Because it shows I there's three of them in there. All right. Why don't you go ahead and try moving one yourself? Just use the controls when we went over and move a card. The card you decide to move, we place back to the real spot. Not have the tutorial. Let's go ahead and move the thing. Okay. Huh? No. Why can't I go to the trunk now? All right. Right. 
Okay, it won't let me move it back. I see. So that's annoying. All right, are we done? Yeah. All right, have I moved enough staff stuff for you? Come on. Okay, now it's going back to the trunk. Why? Let me do I was trying to do that at first. See, the controls for moving cards aren't so hard now, are they? Yeah, if you'd let me highlight the damn thing properly. By moving the cards to your trunk, this you can customize your deck whenever they buy or receive new stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. 40 to 80 cards in total. Oh, this was before the, the 60 limit, right? It is 60, right? I don't think it was ever 80, was it? It's pretty damn huge. No, it wasn't it used to be unlimited at one point, wasn't it? No more than three cards of the same name can go in a deck. No forbidden cards allowed in the deck. Only one limited card can go in the deck. Only two semi-limited semi cards can go in the deck. Whenever one of these rules is broken, a warning message will be displayed, so don't get worried about it. It's all for now. Deck edit allows you to create deck. That, 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 okay. Covers the basic of deck editing. All right, that's fine. Okay. Break down what card types are in your deck. The number in the tab indicates how many cards are in it. Yeah. First of all, the card's name. Okay, I think it's just really overcomplicating the simple stuff right now. I. Anything else? Like, I was hoping to just learn a button shortcut from this. Yeah, they'll have that. That wraps up how to view things. You learn to use it right and edit that. Why don't we go over a few methods? Please note, make sure to save content you have edited and lost. Okay. All right, no, this is my trunk. I don't have blue eyes. <laughs> Never confusing me by showing that. Wait, why does my deck have 42 cards? What do I got in here? Dust Tornado, Divine Wrath. Flying Penguin, Giant Trunade, Human Slime, Night Lizard, Nightmare Penguin, Nightmare Steel Cage, Power of Kaishin, Ugh, Salvage. So I should probably ditch two cards here if I can. Torpedo Fish, like I'm ever gonna get that combo going. Water Dragon Fairy, ooh, that's bad. Yomi Ship, Cannonball Thing. Okay. Bolt Penguin's water, at least, but let me see here. Looks like my ace is Amphibian Beast. Damn. Okay. Water Dragon Fairy. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Torpedo Fish. I'm gonna need to open packs to really uh, edit stuff, but first let me get it down to 40. Uh, your attack's gonna weak, but you see you have defense. 2,000 defense. Yeah, Kappa Avenger seems pretty ass all around, so let me just get rid of that. Fifteen hundred, fifteen hundred, fifteen fifty. 1,500, 1,550. Let me put that in for now. Anything else here I should get rid of? decrease its defense by 200 points. Some of these spells are pretty ass, but they might help me early on, sadly. Flying Penguin. May as well get rid of two Flying Penguins. They don't even have defense for them, so... There we go. All right. Why did I have 42 cards to start? Okay. There we go. That's taken care of now. By the way, did you want something? Or are you just admiring me? Same stuff as before, because I talked to you today. There's no one to talk to. Oh, Asprey. What do you want to talk about? Uh, rumors. Rumors, huh? 
Jandon wants to talk to you about dueling. For some reason, I can't concentrate on studying. You're not bothering Alexis, are you? Is Jaden around? My name's Dean. Fire rages in my soul when it comes to teaching. Wait, didn't I already talk to a teacher? You're, okay, they just all look the same, but they got different names. You're a transfer student, right? We got selected as a recommended duelist. Speak up. What's a recommended duelist? Any student can qualify as a recommended duelist. A lottery is held every day to select the winners. Winners receive a congrats email from the Chancellor. Just show me the congrats email, and I'll give you some DP. The congrats email is only valid for one day. If you let a day pass without authenticating, you won't be able to get your DP. Uh, I have no email. No one loves me. There's a forbidden dorm on the island. Not really interested in it. Same thing. Ask Tristan. I haven't talked to this guy. What's up? You want to duel? You want to duel, huh? Name's, uh... How do you say that name? Genuine question. I've never seen that before. Who are you? I summon monsters even in my sleep. Bring it on. Ha, the anti-rule is against school policy. Even if they allowed it, I wouldn't, it so, wouldn't, so don't do it. Delage? Is that how you say it? I'm Pablo. Who are you? From Slifer Red. Don't forget your lowly rank. Okay. What are you hiding here for? Oh, because he's hide. Ha ha ha. Funny. Alright, it's 4 p.m. School's over. Let's go home. Everyone's still at class. Uh... Main gate. This is a new person. You're that transfer student, aren't you? Name's Colin. Nice to meet you. By the way, do you have a card crush in your deck? Oh, good. Another one. Why is it always the people from Raw Yellow? What's a card crush? You don't know what a card crush is? Card crush serves no real purpose. It's a card that's in your deck only as eye candy. <laughs> that's- they're a lot of baloney if you ask me. Okay. Hang on. Uh... Oh, that's a shadow. I was wondering if, like, a texture was, like, not- like, making it into a void or something. You have a card crush in your deck? No. Very good. I'm- <laughs> Very good. I'm impressed. You have not succumbed to the waifus, my friend. What if I say yes? Yes. What? I'm disappointed in you. Every card in your deck should have a purpose. And that purpose is to win. You'll end up a lifer at Slifer at this rate. <laughs> uh, okay. Who's this guy? First time we meet and here of all places. Nice to meet you. I'm Nova. I'm the light of the academy. I'm the prince of dueling. What are your hopes, your dreams for the future? My destiny is to become the beautiful prince of dueling. My stunning ability cannot be stopped, not even by you. Okay. Hey, I know you. You're the transfer student, right? My name's, uh, Ree? Rye? Pleasure to meet you. Mr. Valian has a really nice skin, don't you think? Uh, okay. <laughs> Just a... Quite a jump in conversation there. Wish I had his complexion. Find out his secret, okay? Um, how do you construct your deck? If you have a certain strategy in mind, try continue his cards. I've, I've talked to you. 91 days until tournament. Let me run. Look at my strut. Alright. Uh, there's a store. Dual field. Maybe I should duel another Slifer. Get some points and go to the store or something. Anyone around here? Hey, it's the Chaz. I don't have time to talk to a loser like you. Get lost. 
He won't talk to you. It's Terrence. I I always understand what's being said in class. There's one thing I can't figure out. I'm saying slacker. Ivan, talk to him. You're new. Hey there, I'm Rune. Nice to meet you. The other day I went shopping with a friend for everyone's favorite treat, sandwiches. What we really wanted was a golden egg sandwich. I always wanted to see what they taste like. We tried over and over, but they had no luck at all. So I tell my friend, Lady Luck is playing hard to get today. And my pal says, she ain't playing hard to get with us. She ain't playing with us at all. Yeah, funny, but it didn't help the hurt one bit. Man, this guy is terrible at telling a fun story. Vivin. Let's duel some Slifers, chat. How about Terrence? Wrong button. Let's duel. Hey, Nat, you're here. I want to try out my deck. All right, time to duel. Win. I'll go first. I don't know. Yep, I just took a drink there. Don't worry. Hmm. Hydration. He had nothing to say. All right, let's win this time and let's not get destroyed by the waifu deck. And before I activate this, I don't know if he has water monsters. Probably the safest bet would just be throw down Yomi ship. Let him attack into me. I could wait for a stronger monster, but I can also just body him right away and go for it. Next player's turn. Here I go. My turn. Stretch? I'll stretch. I'll stretch like I'm dueling. I summon a monster in attack position. Definitely not a waifu deck. Half man, half horse. This monster is known for extreme speed. Battle. Go! My monster will attack. Oh! He didn't even have enough points to kill the monster. Damn. Draw phase. I reveal my face down card. Oh, re respect play. Each player must show their hands. Oh no, what will I do? The AI can see my hands. I reveal my face down card. Your opponent selects one equipped spell from his or her deck and sends it to the graveyard. Oh no, you're thinning my deck. Oh no. What am I gonna do? Uh, who cares? These suck. <laughs> oh boy, chat, what am I gonna do with this guy? He's too strong for me. I like that background change. It looks very nice. I wanna see other field spell stuff. Okay. No, it's fish, sea serpent, thunder, and aqua. Rep reptiles, like, different, of course, but, uh... Well... I may as well put you in attack mode. If he wants to beat over Yomi's ship, he's just gonna eat crap for it anyway. So let's go. Uh, yeah, there's nothing else to do. Battle. I'm gonna send that ship over to attack him. Ow! That, like, hurts. Why would you do that to me? I guess I... Yeah, I basically have a beatdown deck. I don't really have much else I can do except go for it. Turn end. I did just attack the Omi ship. Here I go. My turn. He has polymerization. I'll use this. Ninkendog. Oh, that's an 1800 thing. Uh-oh. Oh, he's gonna do it. Chad, he's gonna do it! <laughs> he's gonna do it! No, don't attack the ship, Terrence. Don't. Oh, you poor idiot. Cool. I end my turn. Chair of the Pain's active now. Let's see here. Violent Rain is Aqua. 
Hang on, what type are you? You're Thunder. Oh, I should get rid of Bolt Penguin next when I get the chance. Alright. Terrence is about to get to like get torn apart. Direct attack. Oh! I tried to do an aw, uh, and I just made like a weird yelping noise. Get him, Gaga Gigo. Ouch, that like hurt. Oh no, I, so I, I don't know how he thought I couldn't do anything when he had Respect Play active. End turn. Oh no, I turn. I get like a split second to see his, his hand there. I'll use this. Great Angus. He's got like some beatdown monsters at 1800. My monster will attack. Oh, 50 points from my hand. I activate my continuous spell. Each player's end phase. Each player can special summon one level four monster from their his or her hand. Okay. Level four, not level four or lower. Select a do not activate effect. I end my turn. All right. It's winning time, chat. Heck yeah. Discard one card from here and negate the activation of a monster effect. I don't think he's gonna have any of those, but I could just special summon this at the end of the turn now and in defense mode, so I'll put Kraken down. Share the pain and bolt penguin are an out later. This theme is sick. Rip him apart. Ugh! Get him cracking. I like this song a lot. It's sick. Hang on. You know what we need? Yeah, we need a teddy bear jam into this is what we need. Heck yeah. Oh, I hit triangle for that for some reason. Heck yeah. Activate the effect? Yeah. This man's cards are just helping me. Now I know what it does. Teddy bop into the beat. My turn. Draw. His dramatic effects with the Teddy Ears is just jamming right there. He's not doing the effect. He can't even use it. Alright. Well, I guess I win. Let's slaughter him. Slowly. So we can hear the music... Heck yeah! Now I'm gonna kill him with the Gaga Gigo. Direct attack. Do the dramatic death. I wiped out his life points. You win! Alright. I can turn off the teddy for now. Cool. I lost! I'm a loser! I should have taken that guy's hint and played waifu cards, I guess. Ha! Huh, you're really good. I'm all out of life points. Let's do it again sometime. Okay. Let me see if I can go to the store now. Buy some packs. It'd be nice if I could make the, the deck I made in Duel Academy, where I just Cyberstein or Powerbond uh, Cyber End Dragon and one-shot the opponents, but everyone in that game's got Magic Cylinder, so sometimes that would just take a really stupid loss because of it. Huh? Welcome. Don't think I've ever seen you before. Ah, you must be the new student. Nice to meet you, I'm Sadie. This is the school shop. Enjoy. Well then. Would you like a sandwich? Only 50 DP each. Uh, what sandwich? This stack has a sp has a... Stack? Does it mean shack? Has special sandwiches. They look the same, but the fillings are varied. It'll help you practice drawing the right card. Wait, 
You mean cheating? You mean sandwiches that help me cheat? Drawing your favorite food is like picking your card. There are many fillings, but your school school's hen lays a golden egg once a day. The golden egg sandwich is the legendary sandwich. Try to pick it. Uh, that sounds like cheating to me, chat. I don't know why, but new students like you can only buy packs or sandwiches. Oh well, guess rules are rules. What do you want to talk about? Uh, hobbies? Nice time, and I wanted to tell you something. I had a good talk. I don't have... No, don't know who you are. Yikes! Oh, hello. I am Geary. Nice to meet you. Sorry, I'm always really jumpy. Do you know Miss Fontaine? What? What a great teacher. Just thinking about her, like a trap card to my heart. Oh, I'm sorry about that. It's just I'm so tense. My name's Andrea. Nice to meet you. Do you know about Gravity Bind? One of my opponents used it against me once and I couldn't do a thing. If you use this kind of card right, it can be pretty scary. Oh, you're the new student? My name's Jules. Nice to meet you. Someday I hope to be a top duelist in the academy. Then I'll be the best- beat the best duelist from North Academy. I don't want people thinking I'm soft because I'm a girl. Talk to Cyrus now, I guess? Hey, Asprey! Are you shipping out to do some shopping? Aha! <laughs> Get it? Shipping? Shopping? Never mind. What do you want to talk about? The Academy. Oh yeah, that reminds me. You got a second? You had a good talk. Hero. My name is... Can you? Why is only one of his the letters lowercase? What? I like shopping more than my three daily meals. That's why I just eat sandwiches all the time. I buy more cards than I know how to use. Why is he like that? Uh, check out that, like, uh, that background there. That's funny. Alright. That fella weirds me out. Hey, Asprey. Shopping. What do you want to talk about? Duels? Yeah, there was something I wanted to tell you. You had a good talk. Come on in. Hmm, you're a new face. Are you a new student? I love new students. Name's Dorothy. Nice to meet you. I work in this here school store. Want to buy something? Hello, want some cards? What are... <laughs> what are cards? Oh, you kidder. Cards for dueling, silly. You learned in class that you need cards to duel. Bought cards are put under trunk and deck edit. Or deck at it, press square when you're not talking. PDA and stuff. If you don't know what cards are, you shouldn't be playing the damn game. <laughs> Want some cards? Yes. It says, normal monster pack. Uh, first spell trap, pack of spells and traps, how magical. Effect monsters, what's an effect monster anyway? Okay, you can't make fun of me anymore, Dorothy. Second set of spell and trap cards. Is that Don Valug, the man himself? <laughs> it is. Emergent fire, it looks like a fire attribute pack. Water sold out. Lucky economy, what, what the hell is that? What does that mean? Hero emerges, Jaden uses these cards. Cyrus uses these cards. Ooh, we've gathered Zane's cards for your en your enjoyment. Okay. Warrior's Pyramid, we've assembled Bastion's cards. By the way, who's Bastion again? What, what card is that, chat? Is that supposed to be one of Bastion's cards? I can't tell because he only ever used it the one goddamn time. <laughs> Platinum Light. Gift of Wind. Earth Attributes. I guess I should get some spells and traps, why don't I? There's a... Uh... How many packs are there? There's five cards per pack. I have 5% of the cards in here, 4% of these. 
I can't afford I can't buy any water of life right now. I have 27% of them anyway, but step up spells, okay. These ones are 150 each. Okay, I can individually select a pack. Nice. So there's only so much right now, huh? I'll buy three of those. And... Two of these for now. And you know what? Give me two of these normal monsters. I got a good feeling about this one. All right, let's go, chat. Bean Soldier! I love that friend. Check it out. Fungi of the Mask. Hey, Island Turtle, I can use that. I can use that. Laughing Flower, Destroyer Golem. The Bone Mouse. Hey, another Island Turtle. It's not terrible. Mask of Weakness. Jade insect thing, life equalizer, castle walls, windstorm of whatever that is. It's rare. I'll let it go the normal speed for now. Pot of generosity, hell yeah, let's go. Micro ray, light force sword. Okay. I don't know how practical that's really gonna be in this. Pot of generosity, ba 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 ba. Grave digger ghoul chat, destruction destiny. Huge revolution. Frozen soul. Taunt. Level thing. Can't make out all the words because of the, the resolution. PSP game and all that. Legendary ocean, that'd be nice to get, yeah. Thousand knives, but I don't have a dark magician. Oh, there's time machine. I don't know if that's really great for me though. Bean soldier chat. I love this guy. Look how bean it is. Is that blood on his sword? Damn, this bean ain't taking no crap. Destroyer golem. So I got one water monster. It's an aqua, so it gets a, a buff from the thing. I guess I can replace my two copies of uh, Bolt Penguin with this. This would be better than that. Laughing flower. For now, I'll just keep working on the aqua deck. Increase the attack of one attacking monster until the end of the turn. I guess I could put that in, like it's fine for now. I have no idea if Delinquent Duo is legal in this game. I wouldn't imagine. You can only activate this card when the difference between the player's life points is 8,000 or... Hang on. Yeah, I don't think I can really do much with this at this stage in the game. Outside of a gimmick. Change the battle position, all face up monster to your opponent's side of the field. That's that's not bad for now as well. I guess it just kind of stops. Multiplication of ants, pot of generosity. Like I'm using that. Micro ray, light force sword, gravedigger ghoul. Send the top three cards of your deck to the graveyard and take a thousand points damage for each spell or trap card you set. Why would I do that? <laughs> not right now. Not if I want to do the equal life equalizer stuff. Frozen Soul. You can activate this card on your life points or 2,000 lore in your opponents. Skip your opponent's next battle phase. Yeah, I don't really want to do the setup with Destruction of Destiny for that. Turn your opponent's main phase one. Select one monster to your side of the field. Activate this card as long as the selected monster is on the field. Your opponent's attacks the monster this turn. He or she must select the select monster as the attack target. Okay. Level Conversion Lab. Earthbound Spirit. Okay. Uh... Earthbound Spirits. I thought I was referring to, like, the Earthbound Immortals for a second. I was like, isn't that a bit early for that? Have the attack of one face-up monster and add the same attack to attack the face-up monster on the field until the end of this turn. Uh, it's not the worst thing in the world compared to what I have. It's better than my meager, like, uh, Aqua buff. Description. Pick the top card of your opponent's deck. Picked up card is can be normal summon. Special summon it to your side of the field. If not, add it to your opponent's hand. Delta Attacker, Thousand Knives, Time Machine. I don't know if I want to use Time Travel or Time Machine. Okay. Alright. Don't want to buy too much right now. Let's make little changes while we, as we can. 
All right, to the deck menu. Deck at it. Okay, 40 cards in my trunk. Get rid of Bolt Penguin. And... I'm gonna find... There it is. Island Turtle. Huge Revolution. There's all the new stuff, like War Sword, Level Conversion. Mask of Weakness. Put it in. Okay. That in. That should be good enough for now. Change the battle position. I'll face a monster close side of the field. I guess I can put that in too for now. Because I got some crap spell and trap cards in here, don't I? Let me see. The Cure Master. I don't really... This is just kind of a waste of a card at most of the time. I have no reason to increase my life points by a thousand. That's just gonna, like, eat up a uh, space. I could've drawn something better. Yeah, Cure Master's a waste. Not unless I'm... I mean, it's not like I can use Aromages right now where I get the life point gain effects. <laughs> Let me see. They don't exist yet. Steel Shell. Yeah, that can go. And one more for now. Wait, do I, I only have one copy of Umi? I thought I at least had two. Damn, that sucks. That's, like, really good for me, so... Only one Starboy as well. Salvage. I can make use of that. Uh, Power of Kaishin is pretty ass, but... Do I want to get rid of another, like, monster card? Because I have... 18 normal monsters, 8 effect monsters, uh, I don't know, Divine Wrath. These, this triple combo is pretty ass, but this says at least has defense. Hmm. Nightmare Steel Cage is a stall option, Salvage, Dim Pack is kind of okay for now. You take no battle damage this turn. Your monsters cannot be destroyed as a result of battle this turn. What do you think, chat? What's one more? What's the one card I should get rid of right now? You're okay to give advice for this five seconds. I'm working with the crap I got for now, I guess. The combo of torpedo fish and all that stuff. Uh, I'll get rid of those when I get better monsters. I know the Orca cards are useless, but I just need to get rid of one card for now. Just one card. There we go. No, I can still use Starboy. I can still use Starboy right now. I just want my cards at 40. I'm just wondering what's the absolute most worthless one right now. It can literally do nothing for me. At least this kind of... Yeah, this can kind of remove something. Stimpak at least gives me a buff to beat over something. Fiend Kraken. One of those is bad, but hang on. I'm never going to use the combo, so I guess I can start removing the Orca stuff. This at least is a tribute monster, so hang on. Torpedo Fish. This card is unaffected by spell cards. Wow, that's so bad. Alright, let's get at 40. Keep working on my Aqua deck. Oh, I just realized I have 666 DP chat. Damn. Here we go. Nah, it doesn't matter. All right. I think they said 7 p.m. is when, um... Is when you get food, right? Let's make a save. Ah, the PSP save screen. All right. No, 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 no. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Uh, plenty of people to fight around here, that's for sure. I welcome everybody. Didn't realize we had so many people here. Check out the beach. I'm not gonna fight Zane. That sounded like a bad idea. By the way, you've heard of North Academy. One of people get there by submarine. Same thing. Ray. I've already talked for you today, though, right? I have a little brother. His name's Cyrus Truesdale. Bet you probably met him at least once. 
What do you want to talk about? Duels? Hmm, well... Zane's talking to me, chat. Isn't that so cool? Do I really want a sandwich? Like, doesn't it kind of just make me kind of cheat? Like, is that really what it does? I don't know. I really want to spend money on it if I don't have to, but... I haven't talked to this lad. How you doing? I'm Yan. Nice to meet you. You know, most strong cards that are easy to play have great weaknesses, but if we can make up for those weaknesses, they can be pretty useful. Take Zombriah the Dark, for instance. You don't have to attack with it all the time, and finding other cards that make up for these weaknesses is kind of fun. Well, he's Slifer Red. Let's duel him. You want to duel? For sure. Let's do it. Come on, let's duel. No, yeah, I seriously want to know what the sandwich, like, does. This guy is just Gillian with a different shade of hair. Personal deck. Bring it on! Alright. So this I can use to stop when I'm being beat down, or at least stall for a turn so I can tribute for Amphibian Beast. However, 2,000 defense wall is good for stalling, I guess. So let's go. I don't know. In Duel, in Duel Academy on Game Boy Advance, Zane's strategy is just to summon Cyberstein, pay 5,000 life points, and summon Cyber and Dragon, and it's just, like, so silly. Sanctuary in the sky, battle damage to the controller of a fairy-type monster from a battle involving that fairy-type monster becomes zero. Um, quick question. Oh, that's- that's cool background. How do- what's the field spell rule for this era? Is it, um, one field spell for each- each side of the field, or just one in general? I don't remember when that rule change went into effect. Okay, 16. Let's see. It's one at a time right now? Okay. Oh. This card cannot be normal summon. This card cannot be special summon except by attributing one face up warrior of Zera on your side of the field. Well, the sanctuary <laughs> in the sky is on the field. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh boy. Wow, he had the perfect opening hand, didn't he? Okay. If, uh, let me see here. If the Sanctuary in the Sky on your side of the field is on your side of the field by discarding one light monster from your hand to the graveyard, destroy all monsters to your opponent's side of the field. The Sanctuary in the Sky is not on your side of the field. This effect is not applied. Wow. Let's battle. Wow, chat. Uh. I think I picked. I messed with the wrong guy today, didn't I? <laughs> oh, you just give sandwiches to characters? Is that what you do? Okay. Uh, all right. <laughs> so, uh, how much defense does it have? Okay. I can beat over that if I swap its position later. I'm gonna have to stall with Nightmare Steel Cage, but he can discard a monster, or discard, hang on. Discarding one light monster from his hand. He can destroy all monsters on my side of the field. They don't even have to be face up. Jeez. That's, uh... He literally had the perfect opening hand. That's absurd. I might be boned here, chat. Mmm. I gotta hope he just doesn't have light monsters then. So I'm gonna activate Nightmare Steel Cage, and I'm gonna begin the stall tactics and hope he burns his monsters from his hand, I hope. Or doesn't attack me so I can tribute next time. It's okay. I still got dual points. We'll get stronger and we'll kill things. Let's do it. Stand by, main phase. Okay. He's got nothing to discard. He could draw in easily, though. Gain attack. Alright, good, good, good. Do I go for the tribute now? It all depends on if he, uh... No, I'm gonna set. If he draws a light monster and he wants to discard it, he can just do some silly shenanigans. So let's just see. It's 
my turn. I draw. Okay, he's got nothing. My turn is over. Okay. I should have set this last turn, but I was more worried about him as uh, whether or not he had his thing. He couldn't affect my back row. That's fine. Set that. Hmm. Hmm. Um, I don't recall here. <laughs> okay. I'm trying to think for a second. I don't remember the rule. If I activate this during his battle phase, he can just main phase two, change it back to attack position, right? Or does... He can't do that? Okay. Because I don't remember how the rule that rule works. Um... He very easily just get destroyed now, but... I'm trying to think here. Just wonder, weighing my risk here. I had a cough. Jeez. Okay. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. Ah, uh, whatever. Don't draw a light monster, my dude. Don't draw a light monster. Just in case he has a second, like an MST or something, I should do that too. I need him in defense mode when my next turn starts so I can beat over him with that. Okay. Here I go. Hang on. Okay, there it is. So I want to activate this right now, swap into defense mode, and then hit him on my turn. So he shouldn't be able to... He shouldn't be able to switch it, according to things. So let's make sure... Okay, good. So the rule is, like, when a spell or trap forces you to switch positions, you can't change it till your next turn. Okay, that's fine. He had no light monster, so he couldn't use that effect to burn me, so I guess I'm good. Hmm. Alright then, let's summon this, and I should be okay. Maybe the AI is also just too dumb to do it. The AI just might be silly. What the hell does he have in his hand? Yeah, he's got, like, six cards, so he should. But... He's not su like, he's not summoning any extra monsters, like... Wouldn't the AI go for the summon, if not the discard? Maybe they're dark monsters, I don't know. Maybe this that's the deck- like, he has- it has intentional bad deck building, so he can't do that. I don't know. Watch him draw into Exodia. Ugh. Alright, his, uh, boss monster is just dead now. Ah. Uh, he just got boop chat. Super booped. Can he summon anything, or what? This is it! I summon a monster and attack- that's a light monster. Was that the one he just drew? Wait, ritual- is he loaded with ritual monsters? Is that why he can't? <laughs> is there a ritual? Oh. Uh, or is the AI saving his card so he can do this? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This might be a problem. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> Let's battle. Take this! Uh, yeah, I should probably activate Negate Attack. End the battle phase here. My turn's over. 
I got Island Turtle. This is a bit of a problem. Well, I could still beat over uh, this thing before he does more with it. He's gonna attack Amphibian Beast regardless, so I may as well take the damage and get rid of his monster. Yeah, this is definitely a problem now. Yeah, he doesn't take battle damage because of the, uh, the Sanctuary. He doesn't have any extra- no, okay, it's just the Ritual effect, that's it. Well, time to hope I draw something good. <laughs> that's pretty much it. He really likes this, uh, Zera character, huh? Let's battle. Take this! My monster attacks. Ouch! My turn is over. Oh, good. Alright. I just need a silly spell card and I win. Let's battle. He hit my turtle. I sent a card. Wow, he actually has another spell. Oh! Now that... That right there helps. Discard one card from your hand and return a monster on the field to the top of the owner's deck. I guess I'll get rid of Humanoid Slime. If I would have accidentally clicked my own thing, that would have been real bad. Gotta be careful. Not to miss, miss menu here. Alright. Now let's do a funny and bash myself into a mirror force. Um... Do I go all in? I mean, like... It's not like I can, uh... It's not like I'd be guaranteed to beat him. He'd still have remaining life points anyway. I, I'm, like, I'm just short of attacking with all, all of them. He'd still have, a, he'd still have remaining life points, and if he has Mirror Force or, or something, I just, uh... I may have the life points. I'll leave one in defense mode, how about that? This thing only gives 1200, so it's fine. Don't mirror force me. Oh! Okay, I didn't have it. No! No, you can't do this to me! Yeah, see? He would have had just a tiny amount left anyway. End turn. My turn. I draw. <laughs> he gave up. He got nothing. What is in this man's hand? Like, what is he running? Like, does he just have like seven ritual monsters in his hand? No, six. Sorry, I can't count. Finish him. He's gotta. If he had a spell, couldn't he just use the other ritual monsters, like, as material still? Yeah! Four pieces of Exodia and Destiny Board L. <laughs> he probably would. Alright. I lost. Oh well. New high score bonus. Man, I lost. Well, see ya. Won't lose next time. Okay. Check out that volcano again. 
should probably du duel more red students so I can get my points up. Oops, I hit the line there. I am talk to you at all. What's up? I'm Nathan. I ain't scared of you. I know you. You're the new kid, huh? Well, I'm, uh, real big-hearted, you hear? So welcome aboard. Nice to know you. You heard about the abandoned dorm on the edge of the island? I guess it's old rumor by now, but several students went missing there. Somebody really ought to check it out, you know? I mean, I'm not scared or nothing. Heck no. Alvaro. Alvaro. How the hell I say that? I heard about the abandoned dorm. All right. Let's get some dual points from this guy and go shopping, why don't we? Oh, we got a live one here, yeah? You think you're so tough? Let's do it. No, I'm not scared. Nah, man, let's duel. Let's duel, bro. What kind of weenie cards has Nathan got? Okay. That last dude surprised me. Uh... Tem spatial, spatial, uh, spatial temporal rule. The, the, the war. I'm like biting my tongue saying that. <laughs> Whatever. All right, back to square one. Nice. What do we got? The Yomi ship right off the bat. He'll never see it coming. Mm hmm. My turn. Uh, uh I draw. From my hand, I'm activating a monster effect. What? Using King of the Swamp. From my hand, I... Oh. I, I, we're, I want one of those. This card's name is treated as Umi. Downgrade all water monsters in both players' hands on the field by one level. Increase the attack defense of all water monsters by 200 points. Uh, thanks. Damn, look at that legendary ocean background. I'm really I'm really liking these background effects. Let's battle. Take this! He looks so unsure of himself compared to his body language. Oh! I got hurt! Oh man. That sucks. Main phase two. My turn's over. Next player's turn. Alright. So then, 1500 and an Earth Monster. Why do he play that spell then? So if I draw Amphibian Beast, I should, uh... No, was Amphibian Beast 5-star or 6-star? I genuinely can't remember now. Oh well. For now... Well... Time to start slaughtering him. Amphibian Beast with, with six? Okay, well, if I draw the Orca, I guess I can summon that for free. Ouch. Why are you bullying me? All right, your turn. Time to draw. From my hand? Uh-oh. What you got? you got? King of the Swamp and that thing for... Uh-oh. That's why he did that. That, that equals my Gaga Gigo, though. What? Is he gonna do that? What are you doing? What are you doing? My monster attacks what? You idiot! <laughs> he attacked the ship. <laughs> Good job, Nathan. Good job. Well, I sure did spend a whole lot of resources to do that. Good job, Nathan. This is why I don't need to set Waboku. Waboku. I feel like if I set it, he's just gonna eventually burn an MST or something. Uh, well. I guess jellyfish and crap can just wail on him. I think he pretty much threw now. AI isn't programmed to read effects. Aw, oh, man! We're destroying this boy. 
even if he does get a good fusion on board, I can just bounce it with, um... I can just bounce it with, uh, Return to Square One. My turn's over. It's go time, chat. Now it's that, now it's level five. I'm subbing Amphibian Beast because I can. Don't I get, like, a bonus for tribute summoning anyway for dual points? Maybe I do that for setting cards as well. Just in case. Oh. Finish him. Oh, man. Send him in the volcano. He's dead. I need more Yomi ships since the AI is just going to attack into them. Oh, well. I lost. New high score bonus. Hang on here. Level bonus, turn bonus. Level up bonus, duelist bonus. No spell card bonus, no trap card bonus. So it's just a bunch of random things. I don't even need to pay attention to what I do then. I'm just going to get points, really. Ouch! You're much stronger than me. I'll get you next time. So since I leveled up, maybe I should go see if, um... Wrong thing. Go see if the, I can buy, access the water packs now. I would hope. Assuming the store isn't closed. Maybe buy a sandwich, too. Would you like to buy a sandwich? Yes. Press X button at any time you prefer. Oh, it's random. You acquired the dried sardine sandwich. Ew. Thank you. Why is cat there? Meow. Pet back. Meow. He seems to like you. Oh. Why is the cat following me? The cat is following me now. Want some cards? Nope. It's still not available to me. Well, I don't know what- I'm gonna buy one of these, because why not? And I got 25% of this. Let's see if I can get another good spell. I don't want to go too, too much here. And for now, just one of these. I can buy some of Zane's cards. I don't want to do that just yet. They're only 100, but I'm not going to be able to do anything until I can build the whole deck around it, right? So, let's check this now. Whoa, Dark King of the Abyss. Sleeping Lion. Red Archery Girl. Isn't she five star? Inpachi. Don't need that. Destruction. Lock attack. Under a ruler. Dimension hole. Evolution pill. Dark magic curtain. Okay, so what's in this fancy thing? Element Magician, Enraged Muka Muka, Beckoning Light, Mystic Clown, Mad Dog, alright. No, she's four star. I, I mean, she's better than the, um... She's better than the Jellyfish or Fiend Kraken, I guess. I guess I could replace one of them. That's pretty much it. No one's gonna use Ancient Telescope. Thousand energy. Law of the normal. You can activate this card if there are five face up level two monsters. Yeah, that's not happening. Face up attack is as much your opponent's side of the field and change defense position. I have a card that does that for all of them. Oh, Thunder of Ruler, you can activate this card. Or activate this card during your opponent's standby phase. Your opponent cannot conduct his or her, her battle phase this turn. Okay. Select one monster on your side of the field and move from playing your next standby phase. Uh, not really. This 
monster gets the following effects when there's a monster with the following attributes on the field. Water control, this card cannot be switched. <laughs> yeah, that's useless to me so badly. Beckon, beckoning light. Discard all cards in your hand to the graveyard, then select number of light monsters. Mad Dog of Darkness. That's cool, but I want water stuff that combos with what I got. Hmm. Oops. That's enough shopping for now. Hm. I have a cat now, chat. What do I do with cats? Ojama on the loading screen. Okay. Bean Kraken. Pretty ass. Let me see now. Where is Archery Girl? Archery girl. Red archery girl, right? What's this again? Mace up most of the becomes zero until the end phase. Nah. Mystic clown. There she is. Huh. Is why the hell not? I guess. Taunt. Thunder of Ruler. Uh, it's kind of the same as some other stuff. It's not a big deal. I'll just leave it like that for now. It's fine. Do I have anything special on my schedule besides in 91 days? First test in the school district. All right. Six PM. So I'm assuming if I want if I go to the right places at like the right time, I might find like special events, right? I'm hoping anyway. For now I just have to duel to get my level up. I shouldn't try and fight any main characters or um or anything like that. That'd be rough, wouldn't it? Relationship builds faster with people you talk to if you have a cat. Oh, okay. Seems that a lot of people you're using decks full of effect monsters. I think making a deck that can't set effect monsters just might work. But I've never done it, so I don't even know. You ever try a deck like that? Hm. Let's find out, Shannon. You ready for a duel? Alright, let's go. Hm. Hm. Ouch. I'm gonna go first, and I'm gonna slaughter him. World of Insects. Okay. I'll do it! Alright, let's go. Basically, shield with turtle and summon amphibian beast and slaughter him. That seems to be all what I need to do with this deck for now. It would be nice to build a Cyber Dragon deck, but I doubt I'll be able to get all the necessary pieces from that one pack set. Especially when they only cost 100 points per thing. Goes for the head. No, don't attack me! Oh no! No, what do I do, chat? You just got turtled. Ah! Alright, so all the generic NPCs have the same animations for now, so... Hang on. I end my turn. So, I had enough fun with those. I can turn them off for now. Right? That's what that does. I always turn them back on later. But if we're uh, grinding some points and stuff, you know, it's always a good idea to do this. Okay. Let's hope that he doesn't have a silly face down card. I'm gonna go with that. I'm just gonna go right for it. I assume that, like, main characters like Zayden and... <laughs> Zayden. <laughs> I tried to say Zayn and Jaden, and I said Zayden. <laughs> Funny me. There we go. They all have, like, more unique animations when we duel them, and more better, like, actual dialogue. Alright. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It sounds like a ship name. 
probably is. So that's that. Just in case I should probably set you in case you get something silly on board. Stand by taste. Alright. I'm gonna summon a jellyfish friend. Really, I should have gotten rid of uh, the shellfish for Red Archery Girl more than Fiend Kraken, shouldn't I? Um, no need to worry about Share the Pain, I think. I should be able to beat over that, I hope. Hang on. This is normally... Bugs don't usually have defense. Yep, there's no usually in Yu-Gi-Oh, though. Let's just go for it. Ah, there it is. You can special summon an insect-type monster in your side of the field and shuffle your deck. Okay, that's annoying. I should have just used Share the Pain. Blah. I don't want him special summoning crap, so I'm gonna do it now anyway. I missed my amphibian beast attack, but whatever. I don't want to give him the special summon. <laughs> I'm petty like that. Ouch. Dust tornado. Cool. I'm gonna destroy his face down because it annoys me being back there. Well. I doubt that shellfish is gonna beat over anything, so let's do this. King of the swamp. Hang on. That have... Yeah, just barely enough to... Okay, let's poke him. The Zane pack has Cyber Dragon, but the game is programmed to never let you get the card until you either beat Zane once or go 0-6 to him. Otherwise, the pack does have most of what you need to build build a good uh, Cy Cyber Dragon deck. Really? That's a weird way to program it. Like, you literally- the card literally will, cannot be pulled unless you, do like, lose to him six times or beat him once. <laughs> That's funny. They don't want you to cheese Cyber Dragons early, I guess. They want you to be able to at least be powerful enough to beat them once. I know that Cyber Dragon was stupid good, so I, I kind of get it. Just end turn. What am I doing? Nothing else for me to do. Your opponent's activating stuff. Yeah. I need to know what his face down is. It bothers me. Hang on. What is that? Fulfillment of the contract. Oh. Why would you put that face down? Weird. Well, I got no other monsters here. Ah, I may as well set this in case he MSTs. Let's kill him. Cyber Dragon was too damn good. Still is good. And then Zane's like, hmm, I should use Cyber Dark Dragons instead. And then they were bad. Turn Endo. Alright, we're playing the sick theme, chat. Let's go. How about I just True Nade so we can't activate anything? Let's get him. All right, chat. You know why this this uh, deck is good? Because we got a Teddy, and you know what we do with we do with Teddies, right? Boop. Get him, bear. When this music kicks in, you know you're dying. The overkill. Music stopped already. All right, Teddy needs to stop bopping now. Boop. Heck yeah. Oh man, you really beat me. I just couldn't draw any good cards. I lost, but it was a good duel. Let's do it again. All right, cat, you come with me. They put a couple anime cards in this game. Okay. Well, I don't know how they work. 615. Let's duel someone at the spooky dorm. That could be fun. 
Stuff like beating Jaden three times gets you a special card unlock. Bastion once gets you Water Dragon, etc. I get that. What I'm trying to do right now is I'm getting duel points by dueling the Slifer students because I tried dueling that one raw guy and he bodied me with Anime Girl, like Anime Girls. And he, first of all, he's on my list. I'm going to be uh, getting my uh, comeback against him. Okay, there, there is someone down there. I like the way this dorm looks. I legit would play a whole horror game that looks like this. That'd be cool. Know anything about spirits? Some people can actually see the card spirits, like Dark Magician Girl. Ugh. Let's duel. <laughs> you want to duel? Okay, I guess. Be here. Most of the anime-only cards are, like, limited or banned, I would imagine. Second. Normal duel. Single. Healing boom? Oh, you know he's gonna be a bad duelist now. Alright. Standby phase. Set my turtle. No incarnate activation of monster effect. He ain't got no monster effects for the most part, though. Not yet, anyway. Turn end. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. I did, and I sneezed and coughed a little bit there. Ugh, I'm good. So I guess I want to negate this monster effect. That's right. <clears throat> okay. He has a stall deck. Oh. One of the worst in the game. Oh, okay, that's fun. Hang on, I'm just fixing my glasses. I just, like, muted and coughed and hacked a little bit. All right, so if I kill this guy... So I gotta attack into him for his effect to go off anyway, but I wouldn't be stupid enough to keep attacking me. Uh let's try. He's prop he's got face downs. You say he's got stall, so why not? If he's got negate attack, let's let's start using him up. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. Hmm, okay. Well then. Let's get comfy, everyone. Is this guy just known for being a piece of crap? I guess he is. Okay, no problem. He has to run out of cards eventually. I don't want him special summoning crap. Yet. I mean... Eh, yeah, whatever, I'll do it. Just to stop the effect, because whatever. Nope, no need to check that. He's gonna have more of them anyway, but... Yeah, there it is. <laughs> you can only do that so many times, buddy. So many times. I guess I'll end my turn. All right. Let's do it. Hmm. I wonder if attacking with Turtle would be good yet. I don't know. You could probably have high defense monsters. Let's see. I mashed the button. Oh, he's got that thing. Well, he's gonna thin his deck a bit by doing that. Okay, then. I can see why this guy is, uh, hated. His whole thing is literally annoying-ass stall. You've got two cards left in your hand. Go right the hell ahead. Go ahead, buddy. 
Wow, this is, is obnoxious. You're telling me. Okay. Okay, Star Boy. I'm gonna throw you down. Now everybody gets a buff. Don't mirror force me. Don't mirror force me. Everybody gets a fun little buff now. Two thousand, damn. He had the mystical elf. All right, you think I'm standing for this? Oopsie. Oh, that just effectively cancels the attack then. Let me hydrate, yeah. I'm getting his points down. He has one card in his hand. There's no way he can keep stalling after this. There's no way. <laughs> so probably get me some DP, yeah? And this is a good, good thing to get. When he sets one next turn, of course. Um, I'm scared of Mystical Elf again, so let's do this. Nice. Let's get him. Let's get him, chat. Get that scum and make him pay. Look at that, he's almost dead. Guess that's that. Game over. Shining Angel, yeah. I mean, I'll just do this to get rid of his back row card, whatever it is. What was it? Option Hunter. Let me see that. Oh, I got him. I got him. Activate card when a monster on your side of the field is destroyed as a result of battle and send the graveyard and increase your life points by the original attack the destroyed monster. Okay. Let's get him, chat. Let's freaking get him. Let's see here. All right. Wait, no, I should have used uh, the other thing. No good out here. Because this has a discard cost. I forgot about the discard cost. Oh, well. Too late now. Um, Hang on. Pack you wish to reduce by half. Okay. Well, oh well. Makes no big, Makes no difference now. Because I pretty much already won. Summon it. Go ahead, summon it. Maiden of the Moonlight. That will not help you. This fella's about to get booped like a bear. Finish him. Heck yeah. Life points reduced to zero. Seven eighty for that. Ah, oh, you beat me. I just knew I'd lose. You like? Let's duel again sometime. I don't think I want to. No one else around. Aside from maybe that guy at the start, right? Hey, I'm gonna get there again. Trying to leave. Zane's at school. Bastion at the cliff. Hmm. Who's hanging around the slifer for Red Dorm?
I haven't talked to you. Oh, you're the new guy. My name's Loggy. Recently, I put all my good cards in my deck, but it was like 70 cards. I couldn't draw what I needed at all, so I lost big time. Yes, overloading your deck with good cards doesn't work. This is so hard. You're Aspie, right? I am a, a Sigthor. Nice meeting you. Knowing your opponent's deck can really make a difference in a duel. Like, if you have lots of Exodia the Forbidden One, your opponent can plan for it. The interesting thing about duels is that you can still win, even if your opponent has a plan. I'm Lawrence. I've heard about you. Pleased to meet you. Have you heard about those cards that you can return to the top of the deck? They seem pretty useful, but you have to be careful with them. After all, if you go back to the top of the deck, you won't get new cards on your next draw. It means you're limiting the cards you can draw. Ironic, huh? Can I walk in all the, uh... Oh, Ken. Oh, and there's Blair. Who are you? Eh, who are you? All right, transfer student. I'm, uh, Bonji. Nice to meet you. I'm reading a book, so leave me be. Which book should I read next? You must be the transfer student. My name's... I mean, I'm Blair. Everyone says I look like a girl, but I'm not. Do you know a guy named Zane? He's so cool, and he's good at dueling, too. I want to be just like him. All right. Well, I should probably duel Blair. That might be a mistake, but let's see here. Um, Hang on, let me turn animations back on, since they're technically count as a main character. Did it? Okay, I did have to press X for that. Hmm. Do you know a guy named Zane? Same thing. Uh, duel? What's wrong? Oh, you want a duel? All right. Win. Would they be easier than dealing with Cyrus or Chumley? I don't know. I just have flashbacks to Chumley just having all those annoying beasts and stuff. Ahem. Bring it on. Wow, that model's already looks better. Looks better than the other ones. Okay. All right, chat. Time for my game change and play. Turn end. All right. My turn. Draw. I set a monster. Oh, you didn't you didn't take the bait? What's wrong with you? I set a card. All right, all right. Well, I don't want to sacrifice Yomi ship. Hmm. Do I play it silly and attack first? Why not? I don't know if you're gonna set up anything annoying. Oh, you got Mystical Elf too. That's supposed to be my gameplay, you brat. Yep, it's my turn. Draw. I offer my monster. I summon it. Oh, what is that? Silent Swordsman. Uh-oh. This card is unaffected by your opponent's spell cards. If this card successfully attacks your opponent's life points directly during your next damn off, I say this card is a grave. You special summon Silent Swordsman level 7 for your hand or deck. Attack the face down. Yeah, my monster attacks. Okay, I can also just uh, return to square one it. I sent a card. All right. Discard one card. I can just get rid of jellyfish. Made you waste your resources. All right. Unaffected by my spells. I'm an idiot. Damn it. <laughs> I assume that, like, ugh, duh. I can't freaking target it with that. Which means Nightmare Steel Cage isn't gonna do crap either. Well, damn. Oh well. Ah. Uh, for some reason, my brain processed that as field spells or activating it when it attacks. No, I just can't hit it with anything. Damn it. 
Well, time for Turtle to die then. All right, my turn. Steel Cage doesn't target though, but it says it's unaffected though, not that it can't be targeted, right? So it still think it would it'd still be able to work. And this one just straight up says, negate the effects of your opponent's spell cards that designate this card. Okay, that's just a long way of saying it can't be targeted. Well, I'm about to eat shit for this now. My monster attacks. Pop. Ouch. Ooh. I am my turn. Even Swords Revealing Light doesn't work on it. Okay, it's fine. I guess the best option now would to just let it attack into Yomi ship, if it does that. There we go, because you know the AI will, and the tiny one can't. I activate my monster's effect, go ahead. Bring it. I special summon a monster. Yeah, go ahead. Have two of them. Oh, you... you okay. Please stop that. <laughs> I can't really do much to stop her now since spells aren't going to do crap. My out is supposed to be Steel Cage, and I, it's not going to work. And now she gets to summon level 7. Slaughtered. Hey, I got Starboy! Starboy, chat. This one's level 3. Well. Ah! Uh. I got rid of one. Monster just being completely immune to spells is, like, weird for this era. Um... Well, I guess I'm just gonna have to let the cloud eat shit now. Ha. My turn. The Scissor Man is chasing me. Do not activate effect. Do you not have level 7? Or does level 7 not have the effect of negating spells? I still have a chance. Silent Insect. What are you doing? This card has changed the defense position when it's normal summoner flip summon while this card is faced upon the field. Negate the effects of all continuous spell cards and trap cards. Ooh. She doesn't have level 7? Okay. If she didn't have it, would it even prompt her to choose the effect? Okay. If I can get rid of, um... No, wait, what am I saying? <sighs> wait, wait, no. Does this... How does this interact? This doesn't target a monster. Um... Genuine question, chat. Does this interact with, uh, the Silent Swordsman? It should work, right? Because, like... Them choosing a monster doesn't mean it can't be chosen. Yeah, it's not affecting the monster, okay. Problem is, they get to choose, and obviously they're going to choose Silent Insects, so I have no choice but to kill it. And hope she doesn't summon anything next turn. But if this gets attacked, I'm going to lose. Darn it. Ah, this is a problem. If I activate Nightmare Steel Cage, only this thing will be allowed to attack through it, though, so I might have a chance. All right. Uh, I'm not following anything you're 
post in there, chat member, and not really looking for advice. Let me see here. I'm trying to think about this. Uh, activate share the pain to tribute Starboy. She's just going to choose. Uh, she's just going to choose insect. Shit. Let me hydrate, yeah. And this thing's just going to attack through the steel cage. <laughs> yeah. Really do much and just put this I attack into the stupid insect with this. She's just going to kill me. Hmm. Attack in Starboy, then maybe share the pain in main phase two. It's probably the best I can do. These two face downs are the problem now. Okay. And this should work. Okay, good. There we go. Now I have nothing except Amphibian Beast. Alright. You got two of those in your graveyard, you better not have a third. From my hand, I activate a spell. What's that? Level modulation. Uh-oh. Draw two cards, special summon one... Oh, I get to draw two cards. Special summon monster from your graveyard that includes the level in its name. So during the summoning conditions, the monster with special summon cannot attack or activate or apply its effect this turn. Uh-oh, I know what you're picking. Uh-oh. It can't attack through it this turn. It can't attack through the steel cage this turn, right? It can't apply its effect, so... I'm safe. I'm safe. I have a trap card. Hang on. Okay. Decrease attack in one point, uh, attack monster by 700 points till the end of the turn. Add two water monsters with 1500 or less. I can get Yomi ship back with this. And I guess take turtle. All right, now I'm gonna set this. I think I got it. I think I got it. And that's pretty much it. <laughs> My turn. Draw. Yeah, my monster attacks. I don't need to do that. Just let it destroy you. I end my turn. Okay. Now I got this thing. <sighs> do I go for the attack now? Three face downs, but I gotta do something. I can't let you get another level modulation because you probably got at least two copies of that. I gotta start doing something. Oh, don't blow up in my face. No, I don't want to do lower my own stuff. Ah! Oh! Okay, looks like our face downs are bluffs. Ouch! I mean, ow. Or ouchy, I mean, ow. I'm a guy, right? Football and all that stuff. There we go. Why not go to main phase two? I didn't mean to do that. I can't summon anything. What am I doing? All right. You try and attack into me. Maybe the mask of weakness. Uh. Oh, you got nothing. You got nothing. 
Humanoid slime. Well, now I have a backup defense option. I don't need to put in, throw Amphibian Beast down yet anyway. This is fine. Hold down circle and I can skip the prompt. There we go. All right. Turn end. We went back to normal music. Scissor Man chase theme has ended. What's that? Uh oh. Special summon one normal monster from your graveyard face up defense position while that monster is on the field. It cannot attack. Bring it. I special summon a monster. That's just Mystical Elf. Uh oh. No! You had the third one in your hands! Stop it. Okay, don't panic, don't panic. Battle. Go! My monster attacks. Okay. Um. Now, quick question. If I activate it now, they don't have time to, uh, stop attacking, right? I don't remember. Do I have to, like, press no once and wait for the, the damage step first? I, uh, I don't remember this how this particular part works for stuff like this. You do it during jam damage step. Okay. Okay. Not yet. All right. Okay, there we go. So now we do this and just activate this. Do a little bit of simple math. And now you're... Yeah, you can't back, it, back out of the attack now. All right. That's all level three, level five magicians. Uh, swordsmans. Now let's get Amphibian Beast on board and end you. Game over, chat. Game over. Direct attack. Your opponent's life points have been reduced to zero. I win. Ow. Oh! I mean, this bites. Man, this bites. 739 for that duel. Check it out. All right. Great. I was so close. Well, see you later. I win. That was a victory. Okay, it's 6.30. Alright, I'm back. Let's continue this now, chat. Right now, I was kind of just wandering around dueling random people, and it appears I haven't met all of these guys yet. My name's, uh, Cadam... Ada? Cadam? Whatever. I'm a Slifer Red, too. I feel like I don't know how to pronounce half these names. By the way, you know someone named Chaz Princeton. I guess a lot of people don't like him, but he's quite the duelist. Don't let your guard down when you face him. You must be the transfer student, right? I'm Walter. Ever heard of, uh, anything super fun lately? Too bad. I want something fun to do. I'll give you something fun to do. I'll duel. Some of these names are really unusual, and then it's just Walter. Sure, I was bored anyway. Oh, was there something funny about them? Did I really want to duel them? Okay. Let's do this. First to go. I'm having fun with this chat. I like this. Envoy from another planet. I'm trying to just build up my duel points. Because I really want to build some good stuff. Okay. Main phase one. Activate Umi. Now then, let's see if I can keep you alive for a turn and get Amphibian Beast. My turn. Draw! The animations are so dramatic, I love it. Alien Hunter. 
Okay, it's Reptile. It doesn't get a boost. This, If this card destroys a monster with an A counter by battle, it can attack once again in a row. Aren't aliens, like, really bad? I don't remember. I feel like I've heard people meme about it in some Yu-Gi-Oh! videos that talk about old archetypes. Old aliens are really bad? Okay. Okay. Nice. Just enough for me. There we go. A lot of people did want me to go back to resume the... the Duel Academy playthrough, but it was really kind of boring. All I had left to do was get 100% cards, and, um... It was just me farming the same characters over and over with my Cyber and Dragon deck. And just praying RNG gives me the remaining cards. But I guess... I mean, it's a G another GX game. You're, I'm at Duel Academy. This is as good as continuation as can be. There we go. 1,400. How much does it give again? 200. And... Okay, I, you're Aqua. I thought you were Warrior for a second. I was concerned. All right. I like Duel Academy. I still get comments from people saying they wish I continue it, and I'm like, Why? It's just, I was doing the same thing for the last few episodes. Um, I worry about that face down, but let's go for it. Let's put it down. I still would like to continue the Legacy of the Duelist Link Evolution as well, even though it's been like a year since I updated that. Um, yeah, go to battle. I don't need to use Power of Kaishin. I kind of took a bit of a long break from Yu-Gi-Oh!, There we go. Destroy him. And let's get back to moving here. Blind destruction. During your standby phase, roll a six-sided die once. Destroy any monsters whose level stars are equal to the number... Oh, if six is destroyed... Or, sorry. If the number is six, destroy all face-up level six or higher monsters. That's a gamble. Oh, boy. Bo -bo -bo -bo. Yeah, just roll it. One in six chance. <laughs> well... I guess all I can do is just kind of go for it then, huh? That, like, back row card is kind of annoying, but... Hang on, are aliens... Looks like... I'm only gauging this from one card, but it looks like they might not have good defense. I'll just throw down Archery Girl and go for it. I don't need to use Power of Kaishin yet. I'm kind of afraid to use it now, because what if he rolls the right number of die and then just ruins my damn day, right? Let's try. A 1000. Monster effect. When this card is destroyed by battle, place two A counters on monsters that on the monster that destroyed it. If a monster with an A counter battles an alien monster, he loses 300 attack defense for each A counter. Okay. Okay. Not bad. Let me check this. Hmm. Pardon me. Okay. Almost forgot to attack. Ugh. There we go. Alright. Card game AI is always, like, manipulatable to some degree, right? Guess that's that. So now I just hope he doesn't roll a 6. Or a 4, apparently. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, a five. Perfect. Two fives in a row, damn. Okay. Let me do this. That's fine. This is fine. Divine Wrath. Uh, I guess our aliens put that down. Hmm. 
I guess I can set this for now. So when this, uh, destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard... What a pain in the ass. You might be able to do some shenanigans with me now. Let me sacrifice it next time. Or... Wait, no, this is... The, the A counter effect can't really be negated as a monster effect. What am I saying? Hmm... I if I waste the resources to stop him from running things on me, then he rolls the die anyway. That might be a pain in the ass. <laughs> wait a second. Oh. Oh, wait! I thought this was for water... water types in general. No, I can't even use this on Amphibian Beast. Damn, this card is ass! <laughs> I can't even, like, do crap with it. Ugh. Well, whatever then. Battle phase it is. I gotta get rid of that one ASAP. Ah. Okay. I activate my monster effect. Oh, no, no, no. Don't want to check the card details. Okay, I can't negate that because I said that turn. That's fine. Well... Oh, why did I go to main phase two? I didn't mean to do that. This is fine. Power of Kaishin is just, um, discard fodder now. Don't. This strategy is so dumb and inconsistent, but when it goes off, it's gonna be really annoying. I set a card. I set a card. Alright, chat. It's time for the best music. Which means it's time for a boppin' teddy bear. Okay. This is an aqua. Summon a second amphibian beast. Am I getting rid of turtle? I should be fine. Hell, yes, chat. Nope, I mashed axe too fast there. Alien Hunter again. The Teddy is jamming, chat. Jamming to this guy's death. Alright, looks like that's it. End turn. My turn. I set a monster. Luckily, his stupid dice effect didn't activate. <laughs> Hell yeah. The bear is groovin'. Let's finish him. Making sure you die. I activate my monster's effect. Does nothing. Place one A counter on your uh, face-up monster on the opponent's side of the field. <laughs> yeah, like me st let me stop that. He used it on the worst one, too. Oh, another one. Uh, okay. And he's draw a card. Finish him. Ah! Alright. Bear retired. I lost. How could I? Oh, oh. <laughs> I lost. Shucks, but shoot. Now I'm bored again. And see how many I got for that. 645. Can I still go to the store? Too late. talk both these guys. Oh, that's that guy. Hero. <laughs> Hello, want some cards? Yes. There's a new pack here. Endless Thoughts. Continuous Effects. I don't know if I want this, but it's a new pack. One. Two. 
This costs 300, so not really. Let me try. I don't have any of these effect monsters. Maybe there's a good water type one in there. All right, that should be good for now. Taking a little bit at a time, chat. A little bit at a time. Ooh, Panther Warrior. Ooh, Cockroach Knight. DD Warrior. That guy. Great Phantom Thief. Swamp Battle Guard. Gear Free the Iron Knight. Okay. Maybe if I get a deck like that going. Oh, another copy of Umi. That's definitely going in over uh, Power of Kaishin. Forest. Swords of Concealing Light. The Mist. Shifting Shadows. Luster Shield. Prepare to Strike Back. What is that? Spell Economics. You do not have to pay life points. Oh, whoopee! Oh, oh boy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> All right, your opponent hand size limit becomes five. Well, that does a whole lot of nothing for me. Don't have that there. Hold up a second. Felt the sneeze coming. Jeez. During your standby phase, pay by paying three hundred life points, select one non-monster card in your graveyard and return it to the bottom of your deck. Ugh. Okay. All right, that's fine. If that's the case, how about I just buy one more of these and see if it uh, gives me another Umi. You know what, I'll buy two, and that'll be it for now. Take that. There's Yami. There's Wasteland. Skull Invitation. Ooh, I can make my cheesy burn decks, that's right. <laughs> one day, not now. World Suppression. Infinite cards. Okay, that's not too bad. Alright. Let's do that. 22% on that. Deck menu. Deck edit. Okay. Let me find Power of Kaishin, because it's bad. Let me see here. There it is. Dark Magic Curtain. Don't need that. Destruction of... Oh, that thing, yeah. Forest. Oh, they're in alphabetical order. How did I not realize that? And what about Kunai with Chain? Would that be a good idea? I'm not sure. Let's just... Well, what about this again? Each time a card is sent to the graveyard, inflict 300 points of damage. I remember making really stupid burn decks with this thing, combined with other stuff like Gravekeeper Servant. I need to do that again, because it's fun. Was there anything else that I got that I really wanted to add? Not really. Another copy of my field spell. There's that lady. Activate this when a field spell card is activated. Negate the field spell during the turn this card is activated. Okay. Bone Mouse. What else I got? Back to square one. Made of Aqua. Mask of that. Night Lizard is kind of eh. May as well take that out. And... Let me get Kunai with Chain. Hang on, is there a... No. Just hoping there'd be a skip button to go to the next part of the alphabet. I'll just put Kunai with Chain. My opponent's turn attacks, change battle position of the attacking monster defense after activation, the equip... Uh, Train as an equip card, increase the attack of monster by 500 points. Equip a monster inside the field with this card. Okay. Just refreshing myself with a means. Alright, that should be fine for now. Alright, now let's see what this guy's about. If I can even beat him. 
A duel, sure. Why is his name like that? Why is just one part of that, uh... Let me fix my posture. One part of his name is just lowercase. The Mushroom Man. I don't like the sound of that. No one knows why his name is like that. Here I go. My turn. Draw. I sent a monster. Sent a card. I end my turn. Alright. So he's just gonna be normal guy again, so I'm just gonna turn effect off. Uh, wait, no, I didn't press X, I pressed circle. Okay. Hmm. He's probably... He's probably gonna attack into this after tributing for something next turn, so I could get away with that and make him waste resources, perhaps. Wait, what? Oh, you piece of crap. Who unironically uses Shadow of Eyes? Well, I'll get rid of his monster then. You flipped me face up. You can activate this card and your opponent sets a monster, change it to face up attack. If the monster has a flip effect, it is not activated. But yeah, that's not confusing wording because it still activates it. <laughs> it still activates it anyway. <laughs> it's like they put that in the deck and they didn't realize it would still do that. Well, now I gotta protect this thing, don't I? Uh, it powers up itself because of its own effect. This down, this down, and I guess we'll attack. Direct attack. All right. End turn. in the wording. Yeah, I know there's a difference between the big capital letters that say flip and when the card says when this card is flipped face up. It's confusing. Jerry Beans Man. I look over and he's and he's got this thing. Jerry, a bean soldier, believes he's the strongest warrior in the world, but his true abilities are still untested. Your opponent declared battle. Not yet. All right. Goodbye, Jerry Beans Man. You never stood a chance. Hey, got Umi. Need just a uh, terraforming and another copy of Umi too. All right, so you give a buff, so it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world since I have negate attack anyway. I'll just put turtle in attack mode and attack ya. I'm blowing all my resources like a real duelist should. The bean just got bean, chat. The world is a darker place without Jerry. Standby phase, main phase. Your opponent got nothing. No. Okay. So... You can select one or both effects, right? Okay. It has to be- the other one has to be declared when it attacks. Alright, so that's fine. A sacrifice turtle, because Nightmare Penguin gives a buff by being on the field itself. Okay, he had no nothing. And it's just Mushroom Man, which has what? If player controlling this monster loses 300 life points each of their standby phases, when this card is face up on the field, control this card is shifted to your opponent by paying 500 life points at your own end phase. What a terrible, stupid card. <laughs> okay. Don't need that. Let's rip them apart. 
Turn end. End phase. All right. It's victory time, chat. Let's slaughter him. Uh... Okay. He got rid of Kunai with Chain. Good for him. Attack him for as much extra damage as possible. I think that's good for extra jewel points. You win. Your opponent has died. New high score bonus. 531. I lost. You're tough. Let's duel again. Hero. Everybody's been battled now, for the most part. It's 7 p.m., Chad. It's nighttime. Let's go to the dorm. They're just side by side, Walter and that person. Okay, that's a door. Okay, it shows the name of their deck now that I've dueled them once. That's cool. Lawrence. I haven't talked to you. Hey, you're the new student in Asprey, right? My name's Taku. Nice to meet you. You like tag duels, huh? Just like me. They offer a whole different kind of challenge, don't they? Blair, Serene Silence, Rio. Lyman Banner. Ah, hello, Asprey. How are things studying hard? Fair play. There's Jaden, Cyrus. Hey, Asprey, you gotta say grace before you start eating. Ready? Grace. Meow. Oh, Pharaoh. What do you want to talk about? Uh, duels? Ah, just the person I wanted to see. He had a great talk. The cat made it a great talk. Hey, Asprey, you just made it. It's first come, first serve with food. You better come on time. You want to eat your fill. Meow. Hey, Pharaoh. What do you want to talk about? Uh, dueling? I was just thinking I wanted to talk to you. You had a great talk. What about Chumley? Your dried sardine is bigger than mine. Meow. Hey, Pharaoh. What do you want to talk about? Uh, hobbies? You want to talk to me? You had a great talk. Alright. Why are they all blushing? I don't know. Maybe I'd look just that good. Fair play. So, do I actually get food here, or what? Don't think I do. Hmm, do I want to try and duel Jaden? I feel like that would just blow up in my face so freaking badly. Talk about hot sauce. I can't talk to them multiple times, right? You don't want your fermented beans? I'll take them. Oh, is that what happened to Jerry Beans, man? How unfortunate. The food in this dorm is like monk's food. <laughs> I guess I may as well keep exploring. Jerry's dead. Can I just enter everybody's room? Yes, I can. Looks messy in here. They're not gonna eat food. I guess I explore. I don't really have to go home at that hour, apparently. Maybe I should just say heck it and try and duel Zane. Unlock my cyber dragons. I have a cat, so that helps. I've talked to you. Rune. Are you challenging me to a duel, are you? Hmm, you've got guts. But I'm afraid it takes more than guts to be an expert duelist. 
Meow. Marrow. What do you want to talk about? Duels. You listen? You had a great talk. Nice. Let's duel. Alright, I'll accept your challenge. I forgot to turn on animations. Yeah, no, it's fine. I'll turn them back on because Zane's the main character. Alright! This is gonna go so well. Ultimate Mecha Dragon. Either I lose to him six times or I win once. Oops, no, that's that thing there. Alright, I missed his opening thing, that's fine. Okay, chat. So now we're gonna win very, very carefully. Hmm. Cyber Dragon can beat over that thing. Unless I have Umi. So let's throw down this penguin. And hope it goes well. Witness my full power. My turn. Draw. From my hand. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I should have known. No, I didn't want to check the details. Just get rid of my cards. What? Oh, he is not messing around. When this card is uh, uh, when this face up attack position card attack my opponent's monster for damage calculation, this card inflicts damage to your opponent equal to the attack of the monster. Then after damage calculation, is destroyed. Let's battle. Whoa! He just started by completely wiping my board before he even summoned a monster. He didn't even need Cyber Dragon. I activate a spell. Select one card from your deck, remove from play, face down. Junior second standby phase after this card activation. Destroy this card now and remove card to your hand. I set a card. That ends my turn. Yeah, well, I got, uh, rear Yoku. Well. <sighs> I'm dead. <laughs> I've already lost. I could just go for some cheesy stuff. Just summon Red Archery Girl. And then just attack this thing. I'll take the extra damage, though, because of its damn effect, but I gotta beat over it. One Heavy Storm Game Changer. I've pretty much lost. May as well just go for it. Reduce attack by half. That one. I gotta beat over it anyway, so why not? Unless he's got magic cylinder. Ah, there's my face step. <laughs> yep. Yep. Let me just fix my seat here. Kill me, Zane. Kill me. You can't stop me. This man's got everything. Here, see my power. I summon a monster in attack position. No, I don't need attack position. Take this! I attack you directly with my monster. Ow. Yeah, well, I got... Umi. Problem is now this thing here. The only cards in your opponent's side of the field are monster or face up monsters with attacks, 16 or more. This monster can attack your opponent's life points directly. Can this thing just wall now? Alternatively. They got their attack lowered because machines. Hmm. Still can't beat over him. Perhaps I should beat over with Fiend Crack. No, that'll just make us equal. What am I saying? I gotta just defend. I mean, I pr it's pretty much over anyway. Here comes Scissor Man. Here comes Zane with the duelist. The duel cards. From my hand. Oh. Okay.
Okay. Yeah, another one. Ouch. I never let victory escape from me. My monster attacks you directly. He's gonna poke my eyes out with those fingers. Damn. You wanna know why you lost? Why don't you mull it over and tell me? <laughs> He's just walking away. <laughs> he just shrinks. He just shrinks. I got 22 points for losing. I'll be glad to duel against you again anytime. Well, so I don't stand a chance against him, that's for sure. Nope, people around here. Check the forest at night. Let's play here at night. This is a safe spot. Enzo. Uh, hello? Hey! My name's Damon. I'm the man who loves to draw. Drawing is good. I come here to hone my draw skills. It's like pilgrimage. Drawing is good. Do you know what the anti rule is? You play with the anti rule, she gives a card, blah, blah, blah. Perhaps someday you will learn this. What are, you, what are you trying to tell me, Josh? Oh, triangle is a quick way to talk to people. Okay. Hang on. Let me option and turn off that again. Damn. Unduel you. You wish to duel me? Very intriguing. I imagine you are more than meets the eye. May the best man win. I'm pretty sure the, the half-naked guy would probably kick my ass. You see how buff he is? He probably got strong monsters. Pretty sure he runs an Exodia deck? Oh god. Samurai spirit. Wait. What samurais were at this era? Oh. Ooh. Banner of Courage. The A-forces. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Should save True Nade. Hmm. Use True Nade to bring back this and recycle. Hmm. His battle phases are going to be mean. He's probably going to tribute summon something then, so maybe it would be best to just throw down Yomi ship and wait. Can also just if he summons plays a really important one. Or you type spell cast on your side of the field. See what he does and then decide what to get rid of from there, I hope. I hope. Warrior, or, sorry, Reinforcement of the Army. I know what this does. The Zapper. Uh-oh. This monster can attack twice during the same battle phase. While this card is face up on the field control, this card cannot switch. King of the Swamp. How do I check board? Oh, uh, uh. You didn't see that. You didn't see that. I didn't realize that button was automatically set to do that. Hang on. I'm just wondering if there's a button to check the field. You saw nothing. Aside from, like, just saying yes to this. Okay, it's the square button. There we go. So there's that there. He's attacking with this. I want to let Yomi ship just, just die so we can throw that away. And that thing's just pretty much dead. So it should be fine. Direct attack. Um, this one could really add up. Banner of Courage is just that. 
Looks like he's gonna be loaded with buffs, so I may as well just destroy one, honestly. Just do that for now, and we'll be fine. Next player's turn, Island Turtle. I wanna beat over him. I'll just do that. Standby, main phase. He has another one. Okay. It's weaker now, so it's fine. Ooh, so sad. Okay. This will help if I put this down for that. Then I get the aqua buff. I'm, I'm getting all my defenders, and I'm getting none of my beaters here. I want to use stim pack and that just for that. He doesn't have crap right now. He has six cards in his extra deck there. Mm. Let's just wait. Next player's turn, draw. Darkfire soldier. Okay, no problem. Select target from the field. Okay. Uh, when this card's flipped face up, return one card to your opponent's side of the field to the owner's hand, as long as this card remains face up on the field. So let's get rid of Darkfire Soldier. Okay, there's what I want to see. Tribute the Turtle. Summon this, because now it's got the buff from that. That face down worries me, but it should be fine. I don't need these yet, so I may as well save them. Pop this. There he goes. Turn end. I need a drink. Damn. Samurai there. I can't remember. Is Rhoda, like... Limited now? Or is it one of those things where, like, it's no longer just, like, that good? I don't remember if it was ever limited. I might be thinking of something else for all I know. Yeah, his monsters aren't gonna... don't really matter now. Let's do this. Okay, yeah, he just had the set Darkfire Soldier because he couldn't do anything. Um... All right. Mask of Weakness, that's kind of nothing. I'm just gonna set this here. And I guess I'll just start finishing him off because he's kind of just run out of stuff to use. The guy of the blue flame? Oh, that's like a stupid weak monster. I don't know why cards like that even exist. Rhoda is limited because many warrior decks have one card combos. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. And now I pretty much win. I may as well summon the shell uh, the cannonball spear shellfish too. It's over for him now, chat. Slaughtered by the teddy bears yet again. Well, I didn't draw a mother grizzly, but still. You win. Your opponent's life points have been reduced to zero. 188. Blah. That's not a lot. I've been defeated. Excellent work. Farewell for now. Okay. That's that. Hmm. What's my... Can't check the PD thing here. 91 days until tournament. What about the beach? Talk to you. Talk to you. 
again, heaven and hell. Trying to see if there's more students I haven't met. Let's check the girls' dorm at night. I think I know who I'll find hanging around here. Yeah, there he is. What do you like better, Dark Magician Girl or Injection Fairy Lily? Anyway, if female spirit appears, let me know, okay? Jasmine, Mindy, they'll probably kick my ass. That person, haven't talked to you. Hi there, I'm Disa. Nice to meet you. Do you happen to use lots of ritual cards? If you if you have some ritual cards in your deck, you should put Manju of the Ten Thousand Hands in there too. But I suppose most people already know that, yeah? Music's kind of loud here. They call me Lily. How do you do? Do you have a second, or are you the type who likes to use, uh, fusion cards? Since you can use them right from your hand, they're pretty useful. If your timing isn't right, performing a fusion can be difficult. I seem to recall that there was a Slifer Red who used a lot of fusions. What was his name? Slacker or something? I can just barely get in there. Male students aren't allowed past this point. There's those, that creepy guy. The forest. The volcano. Anything here at night? That person. Ori. Matthew. Craig. Stuck. No one here. I'm just taking this cat with me for a walk. Don't worry. It's good. That fella. Jewel Academy, the boys' dorm, maybe? Uh, why are they standing like that? No, seriously, why are they standing like that? That looks weird. Hey, you look as light as a feather. One gust of wind and you're finished. I'm Celia. I am one of the six attribute deck masters. Oh, I see. That's why they're like that. The female master of wind. Known as Storming Cilia. This island is in the Pacific Ocean. Nature is bountiful. The ocean is magnificent. Most important, there is a wonderful breeze. A good place for duels and for vacationing, too. I am truly... I am one of the six attribute deck masters. You think I'm handsome now? Just add water. I'm known as Raging Truly. Do you think Dr. Velian's dual disc is strange? It's because of the dual coat. Anybody with high grades can get one. So why isn't anybody wearing one? Well, perhaps some things are best left unasked. I am brown. I am with the six attribute deck masters. I'm the shadow leader. I am known as Lonely Brown. Hey, don't give me that look of pity. By the way, you know Jade and Yuki, right? I heard that he can sense the scents of a duel, but I wonder what scents of a duel are. Maybe it it means he can sense other duelists, but he, even he can't sense anybody like me. Hehe, <laughs> I'm Rock. I'm one of the six attribute deck masters. Once I get riled up, there's no stopping me. I'm also known as Avalanche in Rock. What, you never heard of me? Well, figures you're new here and all. Ever noticed all the strange looking people? The guy who looks like a koala? The blonde guy? Or woman who dresses weird? All kinds of folks, right? So I've been thinking, maybe I could change my look to stand out too, but I can't find anything that fits my style. Wonder why that, what I should do. I am Dante. I'm one of the six attribute deck masters. I've got a flame burning inside like no other. I'm known as Blazing Dante. Let's light this party up. Burn, Duelist, burn. You know the volcano on the island? Well, the best of that base of that volcano is quite the place. It's the hottest place around for duels, don't you think? Thank you for all the gift subs there, friend. I appreciate that. I am Sedina. I am one of the I am the leader of the six attribute deck masters. I am known as Master Sedina. Do you know about Bastion Misawa? He always scores first place on the written test. Well, I don't like the guy one bit. If anybody should shine in first place, it should be me. But he has the nerve to outshine me every time. I just can't stand it anymore. 
That's Maki. Whoever that really is. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let me check the raw yellow map. Why are you here? What's up? I'm Simon. Asprey, is it? Nice to meet you. Did you hear the rumor? Someone apparently just disappeared on this island. Just a rumor, but what? If it turns out to be true, that would be pretty scary. What do you want? The name's Swin. Don't forget that. One day they'll call me the Duel King. You ever use token cards? Let me give you some advice. Tokens are easy to use, but most have low defense. So play carefully with opponent that has cards that can do excess damage. You should thank me for the tip. My name's Marcel. Nice to meet you. Hey, you know about Jade and Yuki and Bastion Misawa? They're famous for getting along well. They always call each other number one and number two. Pretty odd nicknames, huh? I don't know what they're supposed to mean. Hey there, I'm Ray. Nice to meet you. You know Bastion Misawa? He aced the written exam. You can tell he's hiding something in his vest. Looks like he has six different card-shaped things hiding in there. I wonder what they are. Oh, you must be the transfer student. My name is, uh, S uh Sardier. That's how you say it, right? No, I'm, I'm not some guy off the street. I'm a professor. Really, I am. Oh, the other day, Chancellor Shepard talked to me like he'd never met me before. Oops. I want to check over here. Okay, I've talked to you before. Can I go in the stairs? Yes, I can. Can I enter? Doesn't look like I can. Okay, go inside here. The cliff? The harbor? Wait. These two have an event or something? Why are they hanging out here? Oh, Asprey. Meow. Oh, Pharaoh. What do you want to talk about? Hobbies. You are just the person I was looking for. Everyone blushes when I have a cat with me. All right. Ultimate Mecha Dragon, you lost. Hey, isn't there a slifer named Chumley Huffington? I heard that his father is a legendary duelist. He's world famous, you know. I'd like to go up against him just once. Pharaoh. The Academy. You'll listen? You had a great talk. Heck yeah. What are y'all doing? Yawn. What's wrong? You alright? Yeah, just a little tired. I was just talking to Alexis. Privately, hint hint. Hmm. What the cliff? Have I talked to all of you? Nope, I haven't talked to you yet. I'm Kura. Nice to meet you. I wonder if there's really a Miss Duel Academy, do you know? I suppose she must be really pretty, huh? I'd sure like to meet her. God, all the guys at this school are... Really? <laughs> need to get their mind elsewhere. Zanny. This here's got a nice, fine island. Seeing it's got all this nature and what have you. Fancy a duel just like the rest of y'all. Better research in the woods. Woody. Okay. Names, uh... How do I say that? <laughs> how the... How do I pronounce that? Batai? <laughs> no, I'm not gonna say it like that, because I know that's not what it says. There we go. So your name is, uh, Asprey, is it? 
Honored to meet you. I'll duel with all I got. You should meet with my role model. What a guy. You could learn a thing or two watching him duel. Well, let's duel you, why don't we? Let's get some more duel points. Winning duels gets me uh, level ups, and I need that to unlock more packs anyway. Kura. I like how even though a lot of the names are just like super Americanized, like Nathan and Jeff, and then there's just people who straight up have Japanese sounding names anyway, because why the hell not? Steel Beauty. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, chat. Is someone about to break out the Ash Blossom deck sleeves? Let's find out. Okay, level five was on that. Let's give him the old, the good old fashioned stop the things. I'm scared of Heavy Storm now, so no. Let's wait. Oh, wait, wait, you have 18 cards in your extra deck? What the hell has he got? Cybersaurus. Oh, it's the, he's got the Nerf gun arm because uh, English cards back then. <laughs> okay. 1800. Rare gold. Oh. Attack other monsters other than that. Okay. Okay. Well then, I don't have to weaken it. What's, um, I know that at some point the extra deck didn't have a limit, right? But, um,. What about in the case of the video games? Don't the video games technically have to have a limit programmed into them to function? Uh, I could just summon this thing and beat over Cybersaurus. What's it gonna do about it? And then next turn I can get on, uh, Starboy and make things even better. I'll set this as well. Let's summon it. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess it's just fine to attack him. He burned three cards to bring that thing out. No, no, no. Not gonna activate that. That's only gonna lower my, my attack power. Okay. Guess that's that. Nope. Alright, he's done nothing but set, so he probably got nothing. That's the case. Let's set up Starboy. So I imagine he probably has a bunch of junk fusion material monsters that he just sets if he doesn't have polymerization, so I probably won. Uh 1000, I just beat over it. Mystical sheep number two, yeah that yeah, that's a fusion fodder for something stupid, right? Blast Juggler. Yeah. Ugh. That's so lame. Such a bad effect. And he has no cards in his hand. I win. He has to have Fusionist in his deck, too. Oh, God. He probably does. Okay. As long as his card's face upon the field is treated as Umi. However, there is no increasing or decreasing attack. Do defense. There's an active field spell, but this effect is not applied. Alright. That does, like, nothing for me. <laughs> At all. That's pretty garbage. Let's end his miserable existence now, chat. May as well activate Kunai. And just make it a 3000 beat stick. Worried about defense, so let's see what we got. Oh, damn. Robo Yaro? Oh my god. Damn, this is like a terrible deck, man. 
This is a garbage deck. <laughs> Oopsie. Looked up his deck. He has three copies of Fusionist. Oh, that's so bad. Fusionist is like a fusion monster with no effect, and it has like, what, 700 attack points? And it's literally weaker than like some of its materials. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Oh, that's all of them, right? Yeah, I guess I'm done. Let's finish this boy off. Start the music. I'm just gonna summon this. I doubt he's got, like, Morphing Jar or something stupid like that. Enchanting Mermaid. Yeah, I'm in the battle phase. I didn't mean to hit that. That's fine. Yeah! It's overkill time now. Your opponent's life points have been reduced to zero. Get him out of here, chat. Get him out of here. 678. Not bad. You're pretty good. Couldn't do anything that time. Let's duel again. Zanny. They're the same person with slightly different shades of hair. And jacket. <laughs> well, I should probably go to bed. It's 9.45. Get up the stairs. There you go. Wait. Oh, no, it's a different person. Can I just go in everyone's rooms, though? Hang on. No one's here. Wasn't this the lad's room? Hmm. Well, I feel like I should try and duel Jaden at least once. You know I gotta. I keep pressing the back out instead of confirming. Today was another awesome day. I'll be looking forward to having a blast tomorrow. Oh, hey, Pharaoh. Let's talk about dueling, because that's all you care about. I was just thinking I wanted to talk to you. It's the hat, isn't it? They love the hat. You want to duel? Bring it on. I might get my ass kicked, but... Why not? Hell yeah. New hero summon. Let's do this! Okay. Hmm. Now do I start with Yomi ship? He's got ten cards in his extra deck. Hmm. You might want to activate Sky Skyscraper or something, so I'll use Dust Tornado to destroy that. Let's just hope he does something silly like attack into me right away. I don't know what the AI will do for him. Here I go. It's my turn. I draw. This is where the heroes can really strut their stuff. The field spell Skyscraper. I knew he'd do it. And this means he can't replace mine, right? Assuming it wasn't gonna just replace mine anyway? I'm confused, but that's whatever. From my hand, I activate a spell. I place a monster face down. I set a card. You mean, you mean to say that you throw down some face downs? That's what, that's what you're supposed to say. All right. So now we got an issue. Hmm. Do I keep defending or do I go into to attack to bait his face downs? I got Yomi ship, so I have a backup plan. It could be Clayman though. Don't be Clayman. It was Clay Man. <laughs> oh well. That's fine. Time to strike back. My turn. He didn't even say get your game on at the start. 
Oh, uh, uh, all right. I guess he's not getting his game on that turn. Nightmare Steel Cage. So it looks like I'll summon... I should get rid of Clayman, not only because it's a wall, but because uh, he could fuse that crap and make Thunder Giant. So let's just get rid of Red Archery Girl. I'll keep Yomi Ship on the field, because if he wants to like summon something stupid like Flame Wing Man and bash into it, then I'll get rid of it for free. Probably should put this down now, just in case something goes south. What's he got? I'll use my face down card. Here's a trap. Hero signal. Activate this card when your monster inside of it is destroyed. Special summon level four lower monster from your hand or deck that includes elemental hero in its name. Check out my friends. I special summon a monster. He's got Spark Man straight from Mega Man 3. Okay. That's that. Mm, if he has another clay man and po he are he has polymerization in his hand already. I know that for sure, but he's only got three cards I'm getting a fourth I got a backup plan. I should be okay End turn If I see the car again, I'll check but if there's a typo and then I'll read it but hang on It's all over my monster attacks Hang on. He's attacking with what? Sparkman? Oh. Uh. Yeah, go ahead. Get rid of that. Wait, what? Oh, they tied. Duh, I forgot my defense boosted because of Umi. That's fine. Makes no difference. Um, so now if I throw Starboy down, let's buff everybody even more. Yeah, Jaden, go ahead. I don't care if you attack the ship. Apparently there's a glitch in this game with Destiny Board. How does that work? Curious now. Over to you. Ah! Dead. You didn't finish me off yet. Oh, yeah? Starboy, get him. Go! Face down card. Called? Oh, no! Not called the Haunted! Ah, I'm not going to be able to beat over a spark man now. Manticore of Darkness's effect just doesn't work at all. Oh, that's funny. I remember Duel Academy had a couple glitches for some reason, which was funny. Like, what was it? I think it was, like, the one of the Blue Eyes cards that requires you to have Blue Eyes. I think it, like, is was bugged and you actually don't even need to ha like, have Blue Eyes on the field to use its effect, which is busted. Anyways, let me hit no on that. Uh, replay happens. No, no, no. Not gonna attack it now. He got me, but that's fine. I could just crash Yomi ship into him and get rid of him. Because here's the thing, I know he has polymerization, so if he draws another clay man, he's going to summon Thunder Giant. There we go. So if I can just limit how many pieces he's got to work with, I should be fine. Yeah, it was White Lightning Blast, wasn't it? Is Future Fusion bugged as well? That's a bad one to have bugged in a GX game where you want fusion cards, of course. Uh... Yeah, I guess I'm done. Okay. It's my turn. I draw. I set a card. My turn's done. Oh, I got Amphibian Beast. Uh, I don't want to sacrifice Starboy because of its buff, so I'll set Humanoid Slime. Let's check. Ah! You didn't finish me off yet. The funniest part about Yu-Gi-Oh! is how... Oh, hang on. Oh, Sakuretsu armor, that's fine. I gotta respect it. It's fine. 
Like, don't you love how in Yu-Gi-Oh, everybody is always just like, Oh, I got hit by the hologram, I'm dying. And then, like, a few episodes in when they meet the villain, they have the crap where it's like, What the? The monsters are hurting me for real? It's like, then what were you screaming in pain about earlier? Always oh, slightly bugged me, but this is okay. Turn end, I guess. I imagine beating Jaden would make it so that more elemental hero cards would spawn in the, uh... In the, uh, pack for him. I end my turn. Okay. Let's put Amphibian Beast on the, on the board now. So I know he probably didn't have Clayman in his hand, so it should be safe to do this. Cyber Jar? Uh-oh. What? This is legal right now? Destroy all monsters on the field. Both players pick up five cards at the top of their respective decks. Special summon all level four lower monsters. Oh my god. Uh... Face-up attack or face-down defense. It was just made legal again at this point, was it? Cyber Jar. Attack position. Yeah. Mama Teddy's here, chat. I got a Teddy in my in my deck for good luck. That's always good. They did just ban Cy unban Cyber Jar in, in 2022 late recently. Oh, that's funny. Was it technically legal right now at this point in time, though? This game's from, like, 2006, right? Uh... Well, it's still the battle phase. I can still attack, huh? Salvage will just let me get, um, Starboy and Yomi ship back. Nice. Let's go. It's been at- Cyberjar has been at one for the past two weeks. Okay. There we go. Ah, ow. Why would you hurt me? That's so mean. Don't do that. Salvage. I shall take you, and I shall take you, Starboy. That's good, but not good enough. What? You did not just solemn judgment me over that. Oh no, pay half your life points. <laughs> what a solemn judgment. What a poor solemn judgment, more like it. He used solemn judgment to stop a salvage. <laughs> he used the big no. All right. I'm lucky I'm still alive. My turn. My draw. Look at that loaded hand. He can't fuse anything? He had to discard. That's how much crap he had. W what does he have? I know Polly's in his hand. He, did, he got it first turn. So can he really just not fuse anything? He couldn't even put down enough cards. That's how bad it was. Okay. I'll main phase two summon if he has something. For now, I could just finish him right now. Anything? Ah! I'm like dead and stuff. Damn. That's a pretty bad hand he had there. Oh well, though I lost. That was a sweet duel. You're awesome! Six fifteen. See, max attack bonus. Six points. Okay. I got a level up bonus. Okay. Yo, I lost. Let's play one more time. So that jingle probably means I, um... Like, got more friendship points with him or whatever. Let me check my status. I'm level 10. 
Until next level, dual points is that. Win record is that. I like how the, the symbol for a draw is... It looks like just a a symbol of a guy just doing a shrug. <laughs> like, oh, oh, a draw? All right, shrug, man. Beat up the koala. Ah. Uh, not right now. In fact, like, I've been going for quite a bit. <laughs> Let's see. Get in there, you. Just shrug like a teddy bear. Is it time for sleep? Do I, do I have a poster of Jaden on my wall? I do. It's I see the Japanese logo for GX. Chumley ain't even worth the time. Uh, advanced time. End the day. I guess so, it's 9.45, let's go to bed. 3rd of May, Wednesday. Explanation, you received email. The email icon appears in the bottom left of the screen. To read your email, press that. You can read email, but you cannot reply or send mail. I can't reply, that's rude of me. How are you doing? Have you gotten used to life at the academy? If you make friends with other students, they may send you email like this. This is some weird formatting. All right, Pharaoh's gone, I guess. Room 204. Okay, chat. I've been going for about four hours, just under that. It's probably a good place to save. It does not feel like it's been that long, though. Check in memory stick. Overwrite the data. I like how Ojama there needs to represent the game. Save completed. End game and return to title screen? No, no, no. We can just linger on this for a second, chat. Okay. That was fun, chat. I'm having fun with this. These, like, four hours... About, bleh, four hours or so just flew by. I made minimal changes to my deck. No, I'd say it was pretty significant considering how bad the, the starting one is. <laughs> but, um... It's perfectly fine. We're doing just fine with this so far. It's fun. I already do want to play more, so we'll make sure we can see if that happens soon. I'd be down to do more really long episodes of this. Um, I think I want to work towards making a Cyber Dragon deck and the, uh, the cheesy burn strats again. <laughs> um, I only, like, really did one day of the game, though. <laughs> That's kind of absurd. Um, I'm sure I'll be able to get through duels much faster as I increase my, uh, what cards I got. Like, that definitely happened once I started changing things. I need to be able to beat Zane once, and Zane ain't messing around. Like, he's not- I- He's not, like, exactly all or nothing like he was in Duel Academy, where, um, he just goes for that one, one strat where he just uses all his life points to try and get Cyber End Dragon out. Is Cyberstein even, like, legal in this game? I'm not even sure. But anyways, this is where we'll stop episode one. I hope you enjoyed. I'd like to do some more of this soon. Let me know if you had fun, and have a good night. Bye-bye.